including falling, um, swing boat, is we're going to be in jolly old England for a while. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> Can we try out in the uh, after? Huh? <coughs> Can we try out in the after? The light may be hard for me. Jesus Christ, goddamn it, I fucking hate you so much. <laughs> we're there to pull up these goddamn rules, and if I can find it, you're getting banned. <laughs> you're <laughs> Uh, that's the thing, I want you to find it. Or no, technically this is a living game. That's the thing, I couldn't find it. So... He, he wants to be a goddamn vampire. <laughs> I feed on the, the um, misery Essence. that you sow. It gives me great happiness. And something. Okay. It's in books now, yeah. on here. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Make so happy our play Victor. Is there a story reason why you need to see a ramp? Okay. <laughs> Is there a reason? Can There's you like give me can you give me three? Three it, it, three story reasons. It's been his dream too. What? It's been one no, spinach. No, look at him. Look at him. He doesn't look like the vampire with stock. No, 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 <laughs> he looks like he ate the goddamn vampire with stock. <laughs> hey. <laughs> hey. <laughs> All right, you said three story reasons. So you mean like background thing? No. Give me. It's like I. I your honest think. opinion. Why do you want to be a vampire? <laughs> <player? laughs> right there. That's one strike against you already. Like. What? I'm sorry. This isn't like Anne Rice the video game. Hey, button. Hey, button. <laughs> I actually don't want to talk about that. Talk about that you know what? <laughs> if I if I committed some genocide in Darfur, I probably wouldn't want to talk about that either. Just put that out there. What you want? You want to expect me to god with this right away? No. no. There's a whole lot of other atrocities we can bring into this. The thing is, I don't know much about the English on the ground, but I'm assuming there's like gangers and whatnot, like there's in uh, the other mm -hmm. towns. So like, uh, there was this random off uh, vampire who started hunting hunting gangers. Uh, I was gonna be a ganger, by the way. That's probably a ganger. No joke. <laughs> <laughs> He's up on my thing right now. <laughs> yeah, no, it's a ganger for him. <laughs> this is gonna end bad first five seconds in. Well, everyone dies. Like, I have an addiction to gangers. He's like, oh, well, you're on a deep one. He's just like, just staring me down. Looks like I'm beating some people. That's gonna be fun. So either uh, he wants to have his way with me or. He wants me to have me for dinner, so either but way. Victor is in thing. England signing the lease on a new um, apartment for, for his flats. permanent ownership. It's called a flat. Flat, okay. <laughs> well, technically this, by the way, was what I was talking about. Spirit Quest 18. Hospitals and hospitals. Uh, okay. This so guy snuck into a hospital and reported the hospital because they didn't know much about the healing arts, including crystals. Uh. What the hell? Wait, he's dead serious. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's oh, he's very serious. You need to watch this. It's gonna hurt me, just like the lady who went to the um the field museum and was mad because they didn't talk about um, dragons. Field museum. The field museum is this awesome, awesome museum in Chicago um, where they have Sue, which is. Surprisingly controversial, um, but they have all these really cool things, and they talk about like how evolution happens. And um, Damn. I gotta push a button. The doc thinks you're gonna get him. So. Here we go. London falling. So, this, by the way, is the thing I was talking about. The, this is the inside of Dante's Inferno. Mm -hmm. so. But Dante's Inferno doesn't exist here, so I'm sad to All right. <laughs> okay.
Here we go. We can start off with why the hell you're all in England. Wanting to get back to uh, wanting to get back to your roots and arrange uh, arrange a trip to England. Not your roots? Okay, an opportunity to see what all the hype was over Stonehenge and the Druids. Still not caring? Okay, an opportunity to flex your running skills on a global scale and make plenty of million has been presented by your fixer. What is uh, Sager Cup's operational status in, uh, in, uh, in I don't think they're as strong here, but they're still pretty strong because they're still we're close yeah, to Europe. Yeah, they're close to Germany. Yeah. Um, so. Low profile. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. Uh, Sager Cup is not going to You've made it to London and are getting yourself settled. But before you have a moment to settle, I, I, I look very uh, like the picture, uh, wearing a long, like normal trench coat, uh, pretty hat with goggles. Nice. Or uh, not goggles, but uh, sunglasses. Kind of looks like I have some makeup on my face to make my, to darken my skin a bit. My guy looks like S Sander Cup burned me. They might be looking for me. There you go. My guy looks like he shot a heroin. <laughs> like he, it's definitely, it definitely has happened. I'm published, yay. He has a shorter white haze guy with blonde hair and green eyes. Just got an email. Sorry. Different thing. <laughs> I got I just got published <laughs> with a uh, with a different company, so yay. Just just like that's just how I just Well I've been where I work with them like in December we put together a thing. And it it didn't come out until today. So, mm. so sorry, I'm happy. Uh, <laughs> we're gonna make it after all. <laughs> so, um, you have all you you've made it to London, and you're getting yourself settled before a mo uh, you have a moment to rest your bones. Uh, what, uh, what, what race is everyone? Orc. I you do. can't really tell, but I told you yesterday. That's fine. Never tell. I don't really hate you. You're you're dirty orc. You look like a pig. <laughs> <laughs> what are you? <laughs> I thought you said you were an orc too. Mm -mm. Oh, I thought it was like you had a lot of like built up English, stuff inside yourself. Um, actually, technically <laughs> my character can't speak anything because I forgot to put the knowledge that's on. But yes, they can speak English this time. Thank you, thank you, Jesus Christ. Because <laughs> before he just went around mind probing everybody. Could you imagine him and me last time? My character who didn't speak, his character just didn't know anyone's language. Well, no. What happened before? He could speak like Ojibwa, and that's it. And what is that? It's an Indian yeah. language. Okay. Show. It's actually our uh, five other languages, but no one else spoke. He's Irish, like no, it's like all, <laughs> all the mind the language knows is there. To so what he would do up. is he'd walk up to people and like touch them because he was like a twelve-year-old girl, and he would use <laughs> mind probe to communicate in mental thoughts. Okay. You're one girl wiping people's brain. brains, apparently. My <laughs> is fun. Yeah, you go up to them, they're like, what are you doing? <laughs> okay. Someone must be well connected to know that you're in London. The nope. crushed pipe Shit. at 2300, 8 Fetter Lane in the Temple District, asked for the art table. Read the object that pops up in your AR. A. Johnson. You were warned about the Temple District before you even thought about making this trip. Securing the center of official and judicial buildings is ultra tight. You've heard horror tales about Data Jack tripping A level threat responses. So, you've keenly left your weapons and gear of a questionable purpose behind. Uh, and I, uh, that's, it's a regular attitude that I'm going to carry. So let me put this in, in perspective, okay? Uh, I checked the, the door. <laughs> let me put this in perspective. I don't carry a knife, and I work somewhere semi-stand-up. 
if you if you worked somewhere semi stand up, walking in with an automatic weapon or uh, no, not even my weapon doesn't. It might turn a few heads, you know. What? It might turn a few heads. Might turn a few heads. Approaching the temple district. I don't know when Have you seen a bazooka before? Like <laughs> they made a uh, uh, a bad misprint in the first um, run and gun book. It might be in there. This is just really funny. They talked about you can't hide a bazooka in Atlas Chaps. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but they so forgot yeah. to put the can, you cannot. So you can hide a bazooka in Atlas Chaps. <laughs> Can I see your book? <laughs> <laughs> Let's see That's if they fun. did it. Ah! Wipe up. What was it supposed to say? You cannot hide a bazooka in an assless chest. Oh, but it, oh, they didn't. But they not. screwed up because they were like, yeah, everyone knows you can. Okay. Except now, in the fifth edition, there's that one exception. <laughs> yeah, it got it got eroded pretty quick. I'm just seeing if they, uh... Like, I got a bazooka. Like, who's got the ass in the <laughs> Yeah, I got the store right now. <laughs> it's like, uh, that, that hurts. Oh, they, they changed it, they changed it. <laughs> where's the, where's the cat? The cat's just sitting here, the dog's just kind of... Poke the cat. Just shove it away. She does that because she wants the cat to run so she can chase the cat. <laughs> and the cat's just like, doing as hard as I can. And until we shove the cat to make it run, he'll sit there and bark at it. Zod built up hostility when you said that. Now Pippin still thinks you're gonna share. <laughs> okay, I'm looking it up right now for you, by the way. You have to be a vampire, because you can. And yeah. You have a toy, and just like the dog, you have to have the bone. Alright, so we're looking this up right now. Okay. It's so he is a vampire. He oh, wants to be really, 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 really bad. I actually do. Did you make a wish? Yes, and I blew out all my candles without telling anyone. Because they want to be a vampire, so... In your part, you could actually do yeah, that. Yeah, so I can fuck with that. Well, I mean, then, because like then, if you are, you technically are dying. No, you're dead. So. Well, so in... Stop it! Go away, Fatty, come on. Back, back. How long have they lived together? And they still don't live each other? Uh, maybe. A year. Yeah. A year, okay, then never mind. She's just like boisterous and he's fat and tired, so. And she is a little. I can like, relate to him. Spazzy. Where's your toy? Go get your toy. Here you go. Get your toy. <laughs> I'm not your toy. Get your toy. Pippin, look. Get a toy. That's not your toy either. I'm not your toy. Go get your toy. Get a toy! Get a toy! Look, there's one right there. That's not moving. <laughs> Get your toy! Get it! She is truly a badass. Patrols are frequent. Drones silently follow the roads and side streets. There's a constant stream of white nose scans on active air, air arrows. It also feels as if communication and active wearers are being scanned. The crushed pipe is a basement level bar off Chancery Road with dark wood tones, a creaky floor, and, and a cool, moist air. All the light in the bar mimics candles or torch flames. And 
Now a single strike is above waist level. This gives the place a more private atmosphere where the faces of politicians, trio stars, and more shadowy patrons are hard to make out and easy to confuse. Seated at the art table, you fall into the latter group. Art table? The art table. You're told to go to the art table. No, it's just art. You're told to go to ask for the art table. And the maitre d' led you here to the art table. Just what does it look like? Regular table. <laughs> 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 There's a doodle. There's <laughs> one doodle. Do you want to make a scene? Because if you want, like, I'm, I'm, you could have a... Uh, the the major team might bring some crabs or something. <laughs> 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 you might be mad, too. I don't even know why I'm here, so I'm not going to do that. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Johnson, the gentleman at the table on unsurprisingly introduces himself as but call me Art if you want to keep this informal or Mr. Art if you need to be formal leanly sculpted but with the finest finest chiseled cheekbone and, a, and the bra and what you can buy Art is she chewing on you? no she's holding her little <laughs> mousing Oh. Is she chewing on you? <laughs> uh, she will go after your pant legs. Yeah. She's a jerk. She doesn't do that to me. So bad. She also likes to bite my face in the morning. My face. <laughs> she also doesn't do that to me. She's trying to establish the pecking order and the dominance. Yeah. Shit on your lawn. No, she shits on the carpet. She, yeah, she gets She's too posh to go outside, to go to the bathroom. <laughs> Cold outside, and there's, there's cats. She's working on it, but she's like, Yeah, how about fuck you? Let me in, I gotta go to the bathroom. <laughs> I'm stressed. Awesome. Okay. <laughs> Art looks fit for a boardroom overlooking the city from a hundred floors up. His accent is American, probably from New York. Evan. Surgery must have kept him looking young, taking a seat in a high bath. Leather chair at your table, he continues. I think you are right for the job I've got. I've done my digging through my connections, and I hope you'll believe me when I say they're good ones. And I've got to believe it is a very fair offer. Art, Art lights, us, uh, lights up a cigar with a match before looking all your faces old. A little about me. I used to broker stocks on the other side of the pond. No, I don't. I do a different sort of brokering over here. And that's where you come in. Is that good enough for you? With a big puff on the cigar and it glows cherry red, illuminating the smooth skin over his perfect cheekbones. Wait, wait, wait. So here's my offer. There's an upcoming vote in, in Parliament. I want to know which way it's going to go before it happens. The opportunity to find out, it's our, the opportunity to find out is already set for you at a societal venue. The pay is 8,000 million a piece via certified credit With 2,500 up front if you agree. How much? 8,000? 8,000. And that's all I have until you accept my offer. Try and negotiate your time because you can see the I don't have anybody. So. Six out of dice. Right, I know. She should be rolling 16, I think. She had first impression. I know. If she don't listen to me, she doesn't really probably listen to you. She bites. We should put a beware of dogs in. So we can't be seen. I want the one that says beware of dogs. The cat is shady as fuck also. Where's all your six? Beware, the, beware of dogs, but the cat's a dick. <laughs> You're gonna need 14 dogs. Stop. Stop it. Get on my nerves, dog. Get on my nerves. That irritates me. Is that enough to kill someone? What? If it irritates you, it's enough to kill someone? Irritate yourself? Well, yeah, it's a 14 and it's 
14, but you also have under things first impression. See? First impression. Uh, when you first meet the patron. Four, five, six. Where'd that come from? 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, there's 16 guys. Yeah. Looking for successes. Yeah, successes, fives and sixes. Oh. Oh, wait. That's success. It as kind of a subtle skill. Hmm? Are those sixes? Yeah, those are sixes. Mm -hmm. You want to? How much? <coughs> Oh. Yeah, good yeah. Just a spell, not a physical or social? Uh, yeah. Well, no, that's well, a four heads. Uh, it's, it's, it's not a social or a physical spell. You could have rolled a two-roll one. Okay. Like magic. That's how I roll it. You're used to that. I'm telling you. I know. Four can die. Why roll 12 and 4? Really? Hey, four hits above you. Fine. Fucking hours if you're doing that. Fine, fine. Ten thousand new units. Oh. This is high as I'll go. Okay, let's take an off. That looks like that. Yep, ten thousand new units. Um. But I. What about whatever he's gonna be profiting a large sum for what we're about to reveal to him? Is no, there any chance that we'd be able to take part in it? Maybe invest our each ten grand or whatever this might be, and possibly double it. I don't know. Well, let me tell you, you can do whatever you're going to do. With it. I'll give you three thousand up front now and seven thousand later. Whatever you do with your money, I don't care. So, here's the particular. He places an inactive RFID dot on the table under a napkin. This is an invitation, an, act, uh, an, an invitation for the lobbyist ball at the Massinet Hotel here in the Temple District. It will identify your party as lobbyists for the Atarashi Cor uh, Corporate Council of Kansai. If you, if you thought security he here was unreasonable entering here, then wait till you get to the hotel. Keep that in mind before you bring anything unlicensed to end. The city takes weaponry and contraband very seriously, and neither is permitted in the parliamentary events. The ball will attend to be lobbyists and representatives of Parliament. It, won't, it starts at uh, 1900 tomorrow evening. The vote I'm interested in is on un the underplanet. Transportation Appropriation Bill 1449A, which will take the place the following morning around 11 a.m. Now listen, you could talk to the representative and get a feel for what way the vote is leading, but if that were good enough, I wouldn't be paying for a team like yours. I need to know. The Speaker of Parliament, Addison Hughes, and his aide will be in attendance. Part of his planning for upcoming votes is tallying promised votes. If anyone already knows how things are going to go, it'd be him. He's a straight arrow, though, so watch your step. He stands, Art stands, puts on a cigar, and strains his hand. Now you have the information, post yay or nay on the London Rock Climbers Forum under the Rushmore threat. Don't worry that it's so public. This information is worth a fortune before the vote, but will drop to nothing once the vote is passed. When was the vote again? Uh, 1100 tomorrow. No, oh, no. The, the ball starts at 1900 tomorrow evening, and the day after at 11 o'clock a.m.
If you get this, if you get me this info, well, it's still useful. I'll be sure to get you the money, the money you got coming. He turns, then transmits a number to you, all through your complex. I'm going to give you this number to reach me. If you use it, it will likely be the last time I ever use you. This means emergencies only, understand? And, like the information on the boat, it won't be worth anything in another day. Anything else? Oh, he kind of looks back at all of you, dusts off his coat, and gets ready to leave. Any last okay. words? Okay, then? No. Alright. I'm mean, back. Finally, I haven't been playing in a year. There's really no sneaking weapons into this place, is there? You can no. try. But, it's, but, a bad but idea. It's, it's the thing is, your job is to make friends mm -hmm. and influence people. It, it's a bad idea. There's going to be implemental. Oh, man, I'm not going to fit area. in at all. <laughs> well, you can go buy a suit. He gave you 3,000 New Year's. Yeah, might do the candid up gang, ganger <laughs> orc. I'm a little rough. I still I got my lock up for yes. fucking <laughs> tucks. Hmm. Like, I, I go about this every day. And running gun, they got the fancy stuff. Yeah. That's what I wear. Dude, as a troll. <laughs> the whole time, whole time during this, like I don't even know, but like you're breaking off, talk shit about me the whole time. <laughs> <laughs> I'm saying it to your face. I'm, I'm, I'm completely. <laughs> I, I am an extreme racist against trolls and orcs. So yes, I am saying this to your face. Big tooth son of a bitch. <laughs> the main question now, is. the other guy's talking. The main question is. Yeah. The main question is. Do you understand? Mm. All right. So yeah, I need to see. Him. Mm -hmm. Shadow Google. Which? What do you want to Google about? Just gonna be at the ball. I have a specialty with Chris, but he looks dumb in those names to keep any of the money for nothing with Sadie Cook. What, what kind of Google search would you use that for? It'd be computer, it'd be computer and logic with data processing as you limit. So, computer, logic, so now, with data processing. I don't know where data processing is. It'd be the rating of your comment. Oh, okay. That gives him good. Rating okay. You don't have a rating 12 pound. What? You don't have a rating 12 pound weight. You might have a rating 3 pound weight. Fans down on. It's like a rating 4. Mm -hmm. right, I'm going to probably say this bad. Uh, uh, what's. Is Orzit the. Or is that, that is the orc language. Okay. That's 20. what I figured. Right. Right. I don't know what I got, so. Well, I was doing the same thing, sure. Oh, yeah. She spent like three minutes searching around. <laughs> Basically, all apartments going to be there. Um, How do you connect with Stater Krupp? Stater Krupp will definitely be in appearance. Um, well, the thing is, it's not going to be a... This is kind of like the, like last night was the White House Correspondents Dinner. Yeah. It's going to be kind of like that. Except there's not going to be as much sit-down like like speeches. It's going to be everybody who's fancy in Washington is going to be there. All the Congress people will be them. All the all the representatives will be there. The president will be there. Hence all the security. Like you're going to tell like this is big boy pants on time because if you mess up, like military hardware is going to be on display. So like coming in, there might be a tank on the road kind of thing. Everybody is going to be uh, ready for bear. But you're not being paid to kill somebody here. You're being paid to just talk to people. Well, how are you going to deduct me if you kill someone too, anyway? Yes, I guarantee if you kill some people. Just go find a dude in the toilet, just stomp the shit out of him, <laughs> and get the hell out. Close the door, you get your aggression out, you get a kill, and you're just like, alright, let's go back and go get some punch. <laughs> I like this play. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to kill this bitch. Why? I don't know. <laughs> that happens. Well, hey, people see feet in a, a stall, man? You know? Ask questions. <laughs> what when I was stall still don't ask questions. <laughs> Is my little rag up there? 
Yep. Thank you. Um, but this is going to be big. Like everybody, like this would be a big chance to network um, and establish like who is lobbyist with who. It's going to be a rather large event. You're going to be putting in a lot of work. Oh boy. <laughs> well, I mean, you oh, have first you impression, know, 14th yeah. thing, you also have con, impersonation. You've got all the speaking skills. Oh. <laughs> you made a face. <laughs> uh, no, I made hey, uh, uh, a shaman, and since my first move size, I got I'll toss a lot of skills towards face. Nice. So, yeah, uh, I've got good resistance and stuff. I'm just going to go up the hot to that. Heavy heads and whatever, and just tell them, like, you don't need to stab someone for you. <laughs> so, <laughs> my guys just look shady as hell. <laughs> I'm a good prison, but I pretty much has. I could probably get a job somewhere. Half the dice, my three. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm not going to talk to anyone. I, I have uh, <laughs> social stress and I'm on So, <laughs> nice. I can't go off with my high natural Christmas score of one. That's so kind of like when I talk to Kevin's mother. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> but when we get in there, what do we got to do? Your job is to talk to people. Like, you basically need to know how this vote is going to happen before it happens. Oh, uh, I'm going to be uh, in the I'm corner of my stuff. Um, stupid. We're going to be annoying a couple people. <laughs> Just gonna, um, same here. Search on yeah. the building and the wait staff. Okay. Well, you guys all have an intro, and you guys, he gave that, that RFID yeah. dot he gave you, that's an invitation. You are allowed to be in there. Yep. Yeah, but who knows more secrets than the servants? Mm -hmm. <laughs> By the way, as you guys are waiting around in the bar, but still considering your job, you all receive an arrow message. Um, augmented reality out. Basically, yeah. you get a text. Future text. We can't say that. Uh... Google glasses. Okay. This is from Lady Glendower, Lord of Snowden. Oh, nice. um, ah. Lady Glendower, Lord of Snowden. Yep. The, m the message states that the lady is aware of Mr. Johnson's activities. She's willing to assist in the information you need, and of course, she will compensate you appropriately. The message tells you to seek out Mrs. E. Always at the lobby's phone. She will have the information you need. Nice. Um, for these kind of things, there are it's going to be a mixture of a regular staff as well as um, basically hitmen dressed up. Ooh! So like that's a good way. Like since you've got people with like plates running around, like oh everyone, oh or do you They can keep an eye on things. So you're going to have basically men in black with obvious guns. And then you'll have people who are dressed up like servant staff who, in a pinch, can whip out a razor wire or a monofilm and whip and make some people die in a hurry. So don't talk around servants. Got it? Like this is they, like they're ready for bear. Nice bow tie, dick. You just, just test them. Microphone. <laughs> 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 We're going to pay off so hard. It's going to be funny. We're gonna burn out on the second meet. That's what's gonna happen. Hey, to stay low, stay low key, you gotta abuse the service, man. Uh, Just I, I don't like, know. I have like a pompous so. asshole while you're there. It's like rolling stay in character. It's, it's like rolling into prison. You know, you gotta beat some <laughs> bitch on the first day. Yeah. Just walk in there, just beat somebody <laughs> down with a silver servant trick. Yeah, that's what I'm a ganger. I gotta do that. I'm, I'm a, a king smile. capital hip. <laughs> <laughs> I like this. Yeah. This could be a good day. <laughs> So, all right, so you've been, you've been, you have been told that there's a new player up What's her name? I was supposed to meet Mrs. Ellie, what was her name again? Lady Glendower. Of Snowden. Of is she, is Lord she, of Snowden. Is she the one that messaged us, or, 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 or she's the one we got fine? She's the one who messaged you. You need to find Mrs. Ellie. Can I try and take a look at her? Yeah, you can look up, you want to look up Snowden? Yeah, why not? Right. Google search.
just enough for Elway's or the lady? I love Elway. He's the lady. Okay. Back. Yes, you have all your eggs back. Thirteen on the lady. All right, thirteen on the lady. I'm okay. the guys will the chargers. Um, lady Re er, Rehanan Glendower is the Duchess of Snowden. The Duchess is involved in a number of toxic area cleanup projects. Her support has drawn critical funding and awareness to the infamous London Containment Zone. Her latest project regarding the LCD was to promote the creation of a new transportation link to the zone, increasing easy access to the underground portion of the city. Um, what do you know about Elways? Elways is Lady Gwen Lady uh, Wendower's right hand woman. She often, um, like, basically, if, if the lady is not present, she's going to send, um, out LAs to do her work. So it should be most of the public space of the lady, unless it's in connect. Okay. And anything else? And that took about a minute, so we'll go both those. Yeah! Hey, so it's the thing you want. Do you want to look up anything else, or do you guys want to prepare and then tomorrow go to the ball? Um, okay. I don't think there's anything else that we guess we could look up, because, I mean, I'm not taking notes, but... Up to you guys. Mm-hmm. Alright, so that penthouse that I'm currently uh, staying in while I'm in London, <laughs> I'm assuming that it's high end enough where they press my suits free of charge. <laughs> so here's where it gets Th- This is Victor. <laughs> yes. I'm I'll used to this shit. I'll let you. What what is your lifestyle? High. Okay. If you're if you're willing to spend it a month, go for it. Uh, like, you I spend in like like if you live in the streets you spend nothing. If you live in like the lap of luxury, you spend like ten thousand new yen a month. Victor <laughs> currently has seventy thousand. It's uh, how much does it cost per month for a victim? See, but how does how do you go by month to month? In every every adventure is actually have it okay. right here. So after four weeks, like they have. Well, this I could live high life if I wanted. If you wanted to, but then you have to spend. But yeah. if I wanted to make a, fa- I'm thinking about making right. a face, yes, and I feel like we'd have to come from some. Type Each of mission picks up a square. After you go down all the way down, you pay. Um, that's a week. Uh, no, 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 month is enough. Yeah, that's month. All right. So you pay ten. You pay ten thousand. Then you put you do your next four missions. You pay ten thousand. Then you do your next four. You pay ten thousand. Managing my time and money in the game. Well, actually, when you get to the point where you have six th- or sixty, no, it's seventy one. Seventy one thousand one hundred seventeen new yen. It's like okay. Yeah, but at that point you start getting to cyber the crap on yourself. So I don't want to cyber my cra- the crap on myself. I'm oh, or you can start buying some heavy, heavy grade uh, talismans. Uh, I was thinking about like gun folk guys. That's what I mean. But that's the thing. I want gun folk guys. We said those don't exist. They have different ones. We can get skill folk guys. Like uh, something that'll give you extra dice for your gun skill. Like a dilly boost. Check them out. Check out the post side. Okay. Yeah, I know they're nasty. I, I remember there was like tattoos you could like tap and get your bonus. I got a question. Uh, when can you start getting the higher level, or higher than twelve? Are you have to make? Um, you have to have your contacts too. Okay. So to buy like the really really scary stuff, like I can go buy a hunting rifle and in seven days I'll be Okay. To go buy some military hardware. I gotta have friends, and they can either forge me licenses or get it for me legally. But I have to make a check, and whatever whatever the level is, uh, like if you're on a level 16 thing, I roll 16 dice. 
your contact rolls, connection plus loyalty plus your charisma or charisma mod, you roll that many dice. If you win, you get it, and the difference is the number of. I see. So I, I blew all my uh, uh, fucking karma on a fucking two loyalty four connection uh, gun dealer. It worked out so far. <laughs> hey, you can get some good shit. Yeah, start every game with the XDF rounds. Nice. Alright. So, do you guys want to buy anything fancy for this ball? Um, why? I have everything fancy. I need suits. I'm gonna get some nice suits. So, would you like a pen? Like, like, like a white. Just white on white. No. <laughs> no, no, we can do that. Like, that was it, like it, I'm not gonna bring more attention to my. Well, you maybe I should. You could do that. You in, talk uh, about me. in running gun, they actually came up with that like, fancy. That would in your black pig face. Mm. Yeah. Like, yeah. <laughs> 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 I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm enjoying this too much. I'm not gonna give up any time. So high fashion clothing. Okay. Now you probably shouldn't walk in with the. Um, so what, what I mean by high fashion clothing, okay? You could load, I believe. I want to look dapper as shit. You want to go in there and get <laughs> like, uh, <laughs> like the freaking guys from Dumb and Dumber? Yeah. So uh, they have the moon shade and moon silver dress. I'm a guy, I'm a guy. I don't see how that helps me. That would work. That wonderful. Would work. Yeah. <laughs> it looks really good with your eyes. Yeah, we're not, we're not, Can nobody. I get one that goes with my Decker rig? You cannot wear the big game hunter in there. Come on. <laughs> Just show up in like camo. <laughs> what the fuck is this? Not casual Fridays? Um, if you want, the, the moonshade, moon silver um, clothing is 8,500 new yen. To be fair, I'm only using this character once. Okay. You can spend as much as you want. You can get exactly. steampunk clothing. Is that, <laughs> but is that allowed? Wouldn't that yeah, it's in here. It's. Vishan Housing, if you want to show up and like look like steampunk spe- steampunketeer, uh, they that's two thousand two hundred and fifty. Hey, well look on the bright side. Steampunk is usually set in Victoria, England. There we go. And highly <laughs> dreaded. <laughs> you want a cheaper route, we'll go with that one. We'll um, you can get just get a crappy executive suit. That will increase your social limit by two. Um, that's two thousand. Um, if you just want like the There's Mortimer of London. You can get a Barry, Barry Wick suit for 2600 A Barry Wick suit? A Barry Wick suit. Is that the photo? That's just, um... An Armani suit is 2500 Armani dress is the exact same. Both those increase your wireless... Your, your, increase your social limit by two. As well as giving you a plus one dice pool bonus to uh, social test. If you've got it wirelessly hooked up. Um, I do a search to see if it's possible to sneak weapons into the place before. Yes, you can. <laughs> Alright. Alright, ready? Let's see the result. I don't think this is what going to work. What kind of weapon no, where are you can. sticking it? <laughs> That's my only question. Where is he putting it? <laughs> they, have a, they, have a, they have a capacity. You could try to hide something. If you felt it was useful. Yeah. But you would have to be ridiculously good. Yeah. I would like to just like extend this pen. I got an extendable pen. Mm-hmm. Baton? <laughs> yeah, baton. That, that's probably not going to be allowed. Or a knife. <laughs> it's probably like bad. Or a or something? Well, Actually, they're, they're, they're he's like, I got stabbed once. I don't go anywhere with my knife. You don't understand. It's gonna happen again. Let's. They do have a. They have a withdrawer in here. There is a sword thing. There is a. Look. Look at some RoboCop shit where your leg just opens up and bam. You mm-hmm. do. They do have that. Yeah. Oh yeah. I imagine. Yeah, but you go through a metal detector. All right. Well, if you have an obvious uh, synthetic leg. What's obvious? Like, is it just like? Uh, are you well, no. There's. Pants? There's um. No, because there's a... Mortimer of London Trafalgar sword cane. And then there's uh, ones yeah. that are made to look natural, like this could be a robot hand. And, yeah, it looks and, like and then there's ones that are like metal pants, chrome, aren't you? shiny dome. You're wearing pants, aren't you, though? I think it's... Obvious. Right. Uh, yeah. So no one, no. 
Uh, they, they would hear the noise. It's obvious. Oh, really? Yeah, well, it, it's it's not made to look natural. It's just like here's hard for what you need to have another leg to move on. Start carrying one of the little round. Walmart deal. Basically, uh, it's you know bottom low prices. Well, it, it's cheaper. You can get high grade ones like that, but I love this name, by the way. What? Ash Arms Monofilament Chainsaw. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Let's try to sneak that thing in there. No, it, you don't. You don't get it. It's um, evil, evil dead. Oh, okay. I don't get it. No. You can buy Claymore if you want to. That was doesn't cool. that like have F next to it? No, it's fourteen R. Yeah. I have a question. Uh, like Is it possible to get F stuff? It was in picture. In in uh, that book, what are the qualities for five? Why are we trying to kill people? No, I'm just trying to... <laughs> I don't know why having people do anything, okay? Honestly. <laughs> to be fair, to be fair, I'm the same way. I kind of want to just... Every shatter run I do, every run, I want someone to die by my hand. I don't... Even if it doesn't even... I don't know. You we haven't even got it. We're just like, can you go talk to people? I got a big shit. Let's see how many axes we can sneak in here. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to hike one in my pants. <laughs> He's like, dude, I just killed a guy. He's in the dumpster back. <laughs> He's like, nice. <laughs> He's like, we're just a little High five. <laughs> I don't touch orcs. Yeah. I don't touch orcs. Okay. Uh, you go to that room. Fun. I'll snap. I'll get my hand here. You stand that side. Come over here. I'll go across the water. Stay in the second floor, you dick. Okay. So do you guys want to go to the ball? I kind of do want to be sold up in the bathroom now. I'm just saying. <laughs> do. I suggested it for him. I really like the idea. <laughs> Before going, I actually want to look for a prohib- prohib- probation. Or prohib- prohib- Dude, is, is anyone going to buy anything fancy fancy? I buy it. I, I don't need to buy anything fancy fancy. Just, just the clothing, I feel. That's kind of going to be like 2000 New Year's. Okay. Okay. I've never spent any other shit that I've got except on my thing. Anyway. Yep. Taylor. Yeah. The bathroom I had a hotel you can have it custom fit. So that way you can hang it up in the engine room. Th- this character has played in the new lock, currently. Oh god, I hope no one starts a door. Well the we part sad part is this character has no <laughs> skills in talking and yay. I wish they would let uh, me bring in negotiation. Th- this guy has fourteen of negotiation with first impression, so sixteen die with first impression. Well, oh, it's ones. Uh, All right. I could talk to some people about some street street drugs. <laughs> <laughs> I know nothing. <laughs> so it's I can hear you over there walking with your buddies. Talk to people outside. I got four pounds of Nova Coke. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, oh, so I, I hey, don't know. We just get most fucking dope with the gang, or there we go. I, I don't know. Some of the younger people might want to know that. <laughs> All right. Sky searchlights and rotor drones fill the air around this twelve-story graystone Massanet Hotel. Gleaming black Rolls Royces and security transport block off traffic of this section of Chancellery Road. As promised, your active RFID tag grants you access to the security cordon of assault forces in black and into the hotel lobby. Is anyone is anyone trying to do anything stupid? No, but I'm I'm admi- I am admiring the uh, yeah. fine stupid. Uh, do you have any weapons on you? No. Oh, I, I don't know. Do you kind of see a steel pen? Say so. Roll me a concealability <laughs> check. It's just a pen. He, he just has a pen in his pocket. I'm assuming it's not really concealed, so it's basically the least out of the Correct? Just a pen. What's your issue? Uh, 18. 18. How many did you get? Um, I figured one of the attributes is this. I don't even have the skill. It's just. What, what is the concealability value of a pen? Uh, it's a pen. 
Dude, it goes in my pocket. I'll show you if you want. It's just a pen. Like, here, you want me to draw a dick in your face? <laughs> it's a high value. Basically, two uh, angry looking troll and an angry looking elf. He's going to take that out of your pocket. No, he's, he's going to put it in the troll's pocket and pat you and send you on your way. I hate trolls. Stupid <laughs> trolls. Well, I, I had you in the corner. I feel so like it's I that Atlas bomb with that. <laughs> I, 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 I want. I want to go. Up, <laughs> no, I want to go up to that. <laughs> yes, they are. Be, before um, leaving them, like I want to build for that. Well, before we leave, I want to high five that orc. You mean the troll? No, it's the orc, orc wasn't it? It's, a it's an elf and a troll. Yeah. And the elf takes. It don't matter. High five. He's a cousin. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, He's like nice. <laughs> an elderly gentleman in a red suit looks you over from behind the gleaming silver eyes and gestures towards a large wood panel doors of the elevator. This way, ladies and gentlemen. What crazy human. Human. Good. <laughs> you uh, racist you're bastard, <laughs> dude. Uh, uh, hey, no, I'm sorry. By Max Stout, as racist as I can be on both of us. What race are you? <laughs> He's human. Okay. You're gonna be a poly clubber. This is gonna be awesome. No, no, the hu the Humanist Poly Club is basically like they're they're the next step of the KKK because now we literally have different races. <laughs> so you could like uh, see so like you might only want to think white humans are the proper race. Yeah. And there's different fractions of the poly club. Like, there are some races people are like non cool blacks, but we all have to hate trolls. So like yeah, I hate trolls too. <laughs> so it's it's gotten. Future weirder. So it was like hit being teamed up with him and me would be like the best buddy comedy of a movie that two people hate each other. But yeah. in the future. Yeah. It's better. Like, okay, this is, I, I, I think it's a team like, up between Hitler and Ayn Frank. Go. <laughs> <laughs> the greatest buddy cop ever. Ayn Frank? <laughs> and, and, Frog? I don't know. <laughs> and Frank. <laughs> I don't know, it's going to be Anne Frank in this. Uh, I think a lot bigger shit has went down since Anne Frank died. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well, um, the Japanese have gotten crazy, crazy. They've taken all of their many humans and put them on an island. Mm. So, you like that. You yeah, just I ship them all to one island. <laughs> <laughs> it's like uh, Australia. Back in the day, where yes. they just sent all the criminals. A, a man and woman in tuxedo and black dress greet you on the second floor hall, where double oak and gold leaf doors open by themselves. Two huge the crystal chandeliers glimmer over a throng of men and women in impeccable formal attire, smoking, drinking, and most notably smiling. It's Not great. for long. Nice. <laughs> I put a grenade in my butt! That's everybody back! <laughs> 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 no one's smiling because they haven't seen Europe. They are, 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 in the Matrix, you know that you can actually see there are a few security spiders um, in amongst all the people. Are there? Are all the drones? Can I tell if the drones are linked to the military ones, or are there any that are like private drones? Outside, there there's no drones inside. Okay, that answers one of my questions. Um. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, the, is the military the only one watching right now? Military, there, there are definitely some um, some news channels here covering the event. But no, like... I wonder if you're a third, You know what I'm saying? Like, Shady... Yeah. Coke Brothers. Are the Coke Brothers watching? Yes, definitely. Future Coke Brothers are definitely here. In fact, the Future Coke Brothers would be among these people. Um, Ooh! We because they're... It's like... Ren Raku's here. Um, beat some the shit out of guys are here. Guys and gals. Like... All the big, all the triple A's are here. So the big corporations are, are here. They so are. So one murder could really fuck up a company. I like this. <laughs> I could really destroy a company right now. Uh -oh. 
<laughs> it's like, not destroyed. It's like the wrong day to take a shit today, dude. No, 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 no. no. You, well, you, but the thing is, it you wouldn't destroy them. You make them piss off. Yeah. They don't know. They got a footprint. I do know. Sorry, <laughs> okay. my I, I don't minus twenty five in my sin. I was a Sandra Krupp star child until I fucked up. They won't get fucked up by one death. They might hunt you down and kill you, but they won't give a shit. Not if I do it successfully. Not if I do it successfully. You only hear about the murders that went wrong. Nice. The good ones never get get told about. <laughs> or like Jack the Ripper. Yeah. We're in jolly old England. Yeah. <laughs> So you guys are you guys are at this party. I'm gonna bring a hook. I'm kidding. No, you're not. <laughs> <laughs> you hook handed child. What the hell's wrong with you? Man? <laughs> Ooh, I was just gonna be the new one. Okay. Um, yeah, but you guys are here. There is um, this place is there are the uh, in, am- in amongst everyone. You've got the people who got the little trays walking around with like wine, wine, wine. Rosie. There's like a, a buffet. Um, you see the men in black are along the wall. They've got like their little earpieces in. Um, you even see like there are a couple mages in the group. Like if something were to go down, like someone whips out a gun, like the speaker is going to be probably the most protected person in the world. Dun, dun, mind bolt. Also smuggled up his ass. <laughs> Just <laughs> stunk your head. That's probably me. Yeah, you did right. read more men buy dildos than women. Uh, really? really? It, there's a lot of interesting numbers when you really crank them. Yeah, uh, <laughs> uh, that's what do you people do? You guys are here. You I'm going to the bar. You guys n- wh- yeah, there's a bar. I'm, I'm going to start mingling. What do you want? Uh, so probably uh, uh, you're gonna, uh, I'm waiting for the line. I, I want, oh. I want like if what we did to Japan, I want that in a drink. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> He's every time I want to fuck me up. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so he looks like you want to die. <laughs> so, like, what do you want, Sal? He, you see, he like puts a he puts a glass, he puts the ice in the cube. He just looks at me like, yeah, you would want this. And he it's pours in right? like a uh, uh, like. Four fingers worth of Everclear, and he puts it across there. Like, this will hit. This will do you. Okay. You know Everclear is? Yeah. Okay. I know I'm a little young, but come on, man. Well, no, I don't know. <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't know until I got the couch. Everclear is 190 proof liquor. It's the highest thing you're gonna get in Michigan. Yeah, it's a high. Is you uh, can you even buy it in Michigan? Mm-hmm. Okay. Some states don't allow really you to sell it. Um, it's almost. It's the closest you're gonna get. It's, it's, it's pure grain up. The only way to get pure alcohol is to use benzene to replace the water in the, in the uh, thing. And that will make it toxic. Like you can't just drink lab grade 200 proof ethanol. This is the closest you can go. I just drink it. And I just drank the shit out of it. <laughs> make me a composure test. <laughs> I don't know what that. What does that mean? It'll be on there. Oh, no. Yeah, but start talking to someone. Yeah, so I'm going to find two people in particular. I'm going to start mingling around. I'm, okay. I'm, I'm going to go and start harassing the uh, orc servants. Awesome. Uh, because just, just, you know, walking by and name calling <laughs> Should I, when I take roll, well, should I be taking the dice away now that I'm drawing a whole bunch? Well, that's what the composure test is for. Yeah, I don't. Where's that at, though? I'm looking off this yeah, preset care character. Hmm? Care Don't give her a tongue, but yeah, she'll, she'll be your friend forever. Alright, composure test! Mom. Yeah, but I don't have that skill. Or it's, not a, it's not, it's a two. It's it's a, I'll, pick, I'll pick it up for you. Yeah. I think it's like, um, will plus, like, bots or something like that. It's basically it if you. Be a fort check for drinking. But composure is to see like how well he handles his liquor. Um. Will and survival? I don't know. 
<laughs> Will and survival. Save the woods, man. <laughs> uh, yeah, survival, man. I'm so glad I asked for this check. Should ask Siri. Good. Should ask Siri. <laughs> Siri, what's <the> good? <laughs> <laughs> it's probably got weird flavor. She's like, I don't, I don't. Yeah. Oh, she's never had the cool <laughs> Yeah, I, I don't like the cheese. I like both. I don't know if she's ever... This is so weird. What's going on? <laughs> I want to start mingling looking for uh, the person we were sent here to talk to. I'm looking for the Elway's woman. I searched on her, so I should know what she looks like. You guys start doing your work. I just go to church. <laughs> You can be our distraction later. <laughs> yeah, I was thinking about doing <laughs> that too. Yeah, I really was. Roll will power and body. Roll power and body. Aren't those two of the same sex? Like they don't roll? Yeah, but certain things are different. Okay. Like this is this is like how well can you handle like I got a question. Would be the same? Wow, thing? I didn't handle that at all. Wow, I probably. You, that, that, that's that's I made one. one. Okay. So how many ones did you get? Oh yeah, it's true. Oh wow. And I was just like, I, I, I blacked out there. <laughs> <laughs> okay. so many, what, did you get five? I, your five I got five ones. What, what about this one? Oh, six ones. Jesus. <laughs> yeah, and oh. dude, I told you how I roll, man. I roll <laughs> bad. I'm starting to like so this you. One. Well, we're, we're gonna. We're Should gonna, I pull edge just to re-roll that? You might want to. Yeah. 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 No, you're just gonna re-roll all the misses. Okay. So you keep the one. Keep the one. Okay. Like, keep the one. Know, like this is to keep you from shit your pants fast up. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I'm one shot it. <laughs> yeah, I can do this. Let's do this. Here, here, here. This is like I just got here. I'm like, yeah, I'm about to shit my pants. He's like, good, you orc, you orc bastard. You did ask for the room. <laughs> Oh, that, what we did to Japan? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, <go ahead. laughs> Three more. So four hits all together. The best part about this. The absolute best part about this. We're in England. Japan and England have never been at war. Oh, what we did to Japan! <laughs> nice trade negotiations after a long period of separation, which is mutually beneficial. Yeah. yeah, I want that in the class. It was like 110 years ago, but so what? <laughs> Yeah, four hits all the way. Four hits, that'll do. All right. Yeah, but on the one. <laughs> I was going to say, if, if you did, for every hit you had less than three, you were taking a minus two for the rest of the day. <laughs> <laughs> so just negative one. Well, no. You. Uh, I was going to say minus three. So, or three. Cause, you know, I want that. Let's do four shots ever clear and let's have fun. There's a shot called the devil's eyeball where you put a cherry in a shot glass and fill it full of... So thank you. Oh. And you uh, fill it full of Everclear and you do it and you drink it down. My friends did that. It's fun to watch. <laughs> okay, so you get you are getting drunk at the bar. I was think I had the mindset maybe I, they will need a distraction at some point and I was gonna be that guy. I was gonna be that guy. Um, I was selflessly preparing. <laughs> Alright. You don't get to where I'm no, 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 no. playing it by the rules. I'm telling you that right now. This is where your line of thought. I'm going to get so drunk I'm going to go in the bathroom and kill someone. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Basically. Someone's going to die in the bathroom today. It might be me from alcohol poisoning. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. So, what happens? You. You. I'm so drunk you I think I pop, beat someone up. Kind of. I'm pre-aging all my speakers. <laughs> okay. Alright. So, you eventually see the speaker. And he is surrounded by um he basically got a circle around him of like people talking to him well yeah it's it's like if you wanted to go see the president at like yeah like a state dinner or a state ball he'll like, he'll have his secret service well no it's not even that it's how many people are trying to um get his attention get his attention I, and i'm not really trying to go speak to the speaker i'm trying to um, find the chick that we were told about are you going to the lady too? Yeah. Okay. You find her. She's more off in the corner. Um, Is she talking to anyone? No, she's actually she, waiting. For she's me. about to be. <laughs> um, um, you both see her, and she sees you. Says, oh, don't talk to I I I agree with her. Um, Is she wearing anything that's like professional? No, she is brought to like she like you can see her her uh, online persona. She has her own um deck. Well, no, everyone's got a a combo. 
Uh, but she's got like an online persona that you can definitely interact with. We're trying to get information from her. Well. Mm-hmm. Well, everybody. Send them to the bar. People could people talk a lot of shit with me during. <laughs> Makes a friend. <laughs> yeah. It'd be like Van Wilder than this motherfucker. There we go. <laughs> this oh. is how we this is how we got arrested for the state secret act. Yeah. <laughs> um but she sees you. Um good to see you. Are, I trust you've got my employer's message. Yes, I believe it is. So I know something. I know that currently all the votes have been accounted for except for one. Lord Helsing oh, awesome. is currently not in attendance. He's also not at this bar. At this ball. Lord Von Helsing? No. I'm joking. Of yeah, but is the one vote even going to make a difference? Or is it just keeping it open? Well, I don't know. But I do know you have one vote that you can definitely influence. This is votes in the field? I believe so. Toro College. Uh, Are we supposed to influence the votes or just find out who they can influence? Well, uh, your original job is to figure out what it's going to be. Right. Um, if we influence the votes, then just show that, that we know what the outcome And what if we influence in the opposite way of the dude that's paying us once? Well, he doesn't really care what, what, how it goes down. Oh, he just wants... He would, if he knows... Who's going to come up on top? Inside room for me. Yeah, basically, like, um, if, if, like, the, if a transportation bill is going to happen, if they're going to raise, if they're going to make some sort of something, like, let's say they're going to put a, a new road or a new rail line right to our property. If I can buy that property and the one next to it for a song, and the government comes in and says, okay, we're going to buy it for this much more, I've made a shitload of money. But he needs to know exactly what property it has to buy and before it's going to happen. Um, the, the biggest kind of scariest thing that happened in Shadowrun, there was something called the nanosecond bio with my boy Ares. Because um, Michigan is not fucked in the future. There is a, there's a company called Ares who does heavy weapons manufacturing. And they're they're really based through Michigan in the game? They're based in Detroit. Like in, in 2029, 20, there was something, or no, 2032, there's something called the nanosecond bio, where GE and GE Pontiac made a company in the 20-teens. And this one guy bought 40% controlling share in a second. And no one knows where it came from. He just instantly got it. And this guy showed up out of nowhere. And his name is David Knight, and he runs Knight Errant Securities. So if you're if if your place, because they, they also don't have private security forces anymore, like there's no cops. There's Knight Errant, or there is um, Lone Star, based out of Texas, or you might like or NYPD Inc. <laughs> so if you want if you want if you want cops. Your company, your your city pays for them, and they're a private security corporation. There's actually been tests of that in some states across America. Yeah, I actually did hear about uh, some state actually did away with cops, and they just kind of made their own security, and the crime went down. There's and they were just patrolling <coughs> more, like actually being in the town and everything, and people didn't want to do anything if people were around. So, um... Of the two, though, the two big ones, uh, Lone Star is a, bu- a bunch of good old country boys because basically when they, when the United States fell the shit, the Texas Rangers formed a security company called Lone Star. So they're cops. It's like a militia. Yes. Well, they're not supposed to be militia as they're private security force. Um, Knight Errant is a lot more like a military. They shoot first, shoot later, shoot third, and maybe they'll ask some questions later. They're, they're not people to fuck with. Like you might be able to BS a Lone Star cop, but your average night errant boy is going to whip out a gun and just start shooting pretty quick. Because Ares has a corporate culture of military strength. Like when you're an But intern, what about them, uh, like, together? 
Like, they don't. They don't really work together. But like, what's the what? Are, what are the two of them co- cross paths? Like what's? That would be probably some issues. It's okay. kind of like if the FBI and the CIA met somewhere and both of them had an equal jurisdiction claim. First person to blink or last guy standing is probably going to win. Well, can you tell us about the rest of the vote? From what I've heard, it's pretty close. Cool. <laughs> Um, but I'll tell you this. I, don't think I um, I would like his vote. Um, and I need some help getting it. I'm willing to pay you seven thousand dollars if you can secure me his vote. For seven thousand a piece. Trying to increase it up. Is this mm-hmm. with the other thing we're trying to do? The other, you're just you. Just, you we just need I'm, to know I'm, which way it's going, and I'm they want to go in a certain way. Well, I'm gonna tell her. I'm pretty sure someone else could pay us more. Just when it's uh, the other way. Give me a, give me a, give, give me. A, you're over there talking. Give me a. Yeah, but you see how I roll, right? Well, <laughs> now we're gonna have some fun. I, I'm, I'm sorry. It might be an awkward question, but do you have some? There's some notes I want to take. <laughs> <laughs> this is going to turn into your cheese knife, eh? Um, uh, well, I would expect you uh, to have your own. I have a business uh, of two. I have them, be? but they took it up. Uh, well, so this would, be, this would be con plus charisma. I I I, I, oh, I, I do have time. Hmm. Two hits. You're gonna tie me. Just say I think seven thousand is is fair for this a piece. Oh. She'll oh. give you. She will give you a pen. It'll be a nice gilded pen, and she'll say that will of course come out of your payment. Uh, or I can just pay you. Know, I'll uh, try. Try. Get a little bit. Oh, or I'll she's like, we're not happy with this offer. No, no, no. Wait. Or, That's or, what she's giving. Or I'll pay you. How many do you have? Two? Because we're sh- you're sure this is going to benefit her. Alright. Great deal. I, I, I just want to say something. Uh, John? Yeah. Uh, there's this thing of um, assisted tests where you roll before me, oh, or I roll okay. before you, and depending right. on the number of hits you get, Increases the number of dice roll or the number of successes I can get. Oh, okay. My successes are going to explode, which means I roll another dice to increase oh, okay. if I get. Do you want to say add the, your successes to mine? Yeah, I'll do that. Seven thousand. I'll pay you now for the pen, but maybe we can bump that seven thousand. Maybe to eight. Eight. Mm-hmm. I mean, a lot of money is riding off this. Eight successes. Eight successes. I forget, so I don't have a limit. Okay. Maybe nine thousand. Maybe nine thousand a piece. That sounds like a deal. Here's a hundred for that. So, I believe you're going to need to talk to Lord House, Lord James Helsing. He um, he is a uh, somewhat of a reckless, and because of some of the security threats we've seen lately, recently, he may have made his house into a semi fortress. Security threat. Has Mr. Helsing been, uh, Lord Helsing? My pardon. Has Lord Helton been being threatened for any sort of reason? Mm-hmm. What building is this? This is, his, this is his private estate. No, what, where we're at. You guys are at. Oh, uh, yeah, I got this one. Helton Manor? Uh, no, no, you guys are not there. You guys are at the. Um, you guys are at a fancy, fancy hotel. That's at the hall. Massinet Hotel. 
By the way. Which is a real building, by the way. This is safe for me and you. Oh, I could totally just get yeah, over yeah, there. Everyone can. Good. Then I'm going to go back. I'll just go kill someone in their room. Yeah. <laughs> what? Why do we got to be all weird? Yeah, I'll just go upstairs. Just get rid of people. <laughs> you won't see it coming. Okay. Uh, that's fine. Mm -hmm. <laughs> from Dust Till Dawn, by the way. Oh, yeah. Have you seen the remake? The Netflix series? Oh, my God. That's so good. I think I keep thinking of you as um, Quentin Tarantino's character. Okay, all right, <laughs> that works. I've never seen the one called Dust Till Dawn. What's that? What is it? The movie? Yeah. Uh, Quentin Tarantino. It's actually George Clooney's first movie he did, where him and his uh, what, what's the two brothers' names. Cheech and Sean? No. Cheech is uh, in there. He does no, quarter for roles. Quentin and uh, Queens, the characters. Oh. What, uh, but they're two brothers and they just rob the jail and Quentin Tarantino plays this like schizo uh, kind of dude. And, uh, they end up tra they're trying to get to Mexico and meet this guy but when they get trapped inside they find out this uh, truck stop bar the Titty Twister is like a strip club is actually full of vampires that trap them inside and they gotta fight their way out. Oh, uh, I think it's not like one of the on that guy. It was pretty good. But the series, they did a reimagining. Oh, that guy that was it. And, uh, James Nelson. Nelson. Pretty, pretty good. It's like a, just a long, longer story of that same story. James Nelson. Revisited. Oh, there's a little with nine die. Hey. Lord Helsing <laughs> is the elected representative for the Sunbury District. He has held this position for two terms. There have been rumors of death threats, and the Lord has not been seen in public for the past three weeks. Security around his men has been drastically increased. While he has been absent from Parliament's chambers, he has continued to vote through his remote interface. The All Seeing Eye has a post titled. The last known sighting of Lord James Helsing. It's a grainy, restored video in shades of gray showing a man purportedly Helsing entering a rundown door in an alley with two bodyguards. It cuts out after that. And when the picture comes back, four minutes have passed. Helsing stumbles out of the door, clenching his underarm where a wet spot is visible. Well, if you want to if, if you want to, you can try to improve it with a software logic test. To it fix up the video. Is there any sign of it too? Software logic. That'd be you, software and logic. If it's a software as a skill. I might not have any software. It might be under computers. I have computers. Tracking? It, oh, it's on the electronic group. Yeah, I don't have that. So you can always default and just take your computer's, um, your logic test. Yeah. software, not software. No, I do have software. I have two in that. It's better than what I have. Cyber so, uh, technology is useful, right? Hmm? Cyber technology doesn't know. No, no you'd be using that to pull cyberware out of people. It's my okay. logic. <laughs> Biotech skill. It's my even logic better. Plus my software. Huh? Logic with software. What if I go full VR? Do I get my bonus for that? Yep, I actually have the core. <laughs> I'm going to go to the restroom. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> Don't go to the restroom. Uh, go uh, to the bar. <laughs> Eddie, here's the funny part. I don't know about that, man. The it's adept of software. Why don't you get the restroom with to that one group and the computer no, skill group? We don't got to do the restroom no more. We're in a hotel. I just go to the final room. You do a quick look at it and you're not able to get it. I'm going to preempt this. You're going to free it just as you should. Fuck. Ah. One. Two. No. No. Out of uh, fucking 14 dice, I have four ones and one six. You feel bad about yourself. Right. Kind of. You feel bad about my actions. Yeah. You feel bad. Save it. Yay. That's it. Yeah, default for me to be like four dice, right? 
Yeah. It'd be your logic minus one. Yep. Yeah, about four die. All right. Th this is bugging me, so I'm gonna like copy it down to my the image down to my uh, uh, com link, and I'll try it again at a later time. Okay. Can I tell from the video where that place was? Um, not really. You, you basically get this grainy. Uh, it looks like a. Uh, so should not try an image search. No, oh, it, it basically. What was the newspaper or something that had it? Something called the All Seeing Eye, which is a website that basically is an expose. Can I have the website? Okay. I'll get a question. Who owns the website? Like, it's kind of like a, uh, a TMZ. Yeah. It. Probably Horizons. Uh, Horizons is one of the triple A's. Yeah. Like, it's, it's kind of like. I don't go pack pack Sears. Like if you can do it, you're awesome. But you're still going up against Sears. Who is Horizon just a faceless entity or what? Horizons is like there's eight megacorps that run the world. Horizons is one of them. So they would have like like News Corp owns owns Fox and then there'd be a local affiliate. Alright. So somebody would like there's a TMZ T V show. That would be owned by a big corporation, and that would be owned by a small corporation. Probably not something I could do about right, right, um, the If you want to, if you want to slump the bathroom, you can. The Vera, you're hacking Disney, Intel, Microsoft, and Apple all in one. Yeah, nothing like that has ever happened in real life. Like <laughs> all in one. Hey, if you want to, you can do it. While well, you're in the bathroom, you're like, I can do this. Just slump down to the bathroom. People might leave you alone. Think you're uh, think you just od guys some Nova Coke for a bit. You just hear a lot. Of Shit! Damn! Ah! Oh, why are you in the women's bathroom? <laughs> <laughs> well, not me. Her. They just think she's oh, taking a mic. Where crap. was that other guy that we were supposed to talk to, or he suggested we talk to? Um, that would be the speaker himself. You so, do you want to go? Basically, do you want to go talk okay. to John Boehner? Probably you know. those two go talk to him because I'm not going to do anything. Don't talk to John Boehner. You're going to make him cry. Don't need to do anything. What do you want to do? You guys want to talk to him? They should, but I, I, my guy can't. So you guys have a job. Also, like, we simply need to find out. Go get him, pop up. Yeah. Get him. So yeah, might as well find him. Yeah, I guess. It's not hard to find him at all. Basically, he's surrounded by a circle of farmers. There are all the different, like, each one person from each of the big triple A's is near him. There's a couple of little, little companies like double A's. You know, there's security st staff near him. Will he need to make some kind of roll to get his attention? Um, it'll just take a little bit. Like, it takes, okay. like, about an hour to really get into the inner circle. Mm. Really? It's all the hmm. Well, it's, it's more, even with all the charisma, you're still nobody. Like, you can be a platinum blonde, freaking 11 out of 10, and, like... President Obama's not going to give you the time of day. Like President Hyatt probably do the thing that he doesn't hitch. What? Goes up to her hand door twenty says, um, "Hey, can you get me a beer? I'm I'm waiting over there." And she comes out of her little crowd to say, "Like I'm not a servant, I'm a servant." <laughs> right. And then she's out of the crowd. So eventually, you come up to him. He's like, "Yes, yes, good to meet you. Grab your grab you by two hands. Yes, very good to meet you. I I, I have um, no idea. well, no, like." Everybody here, unless you can choose not to broadcast your um, your RFID signal. The dog's looking down at me. <laughs> and what and what's that signal? Uh, radio frequency identifi identifier. Basically, my cell phone broadcasts the signal wherever I go, um, and that's how it tracks. Everyone has an, a matrix persona, and. When you're in a room, like, if I turn on my augmented reality, it'll pop above your head who the fuck you are. Yeah, but wouldn't that just kind of cancel our whole, like, we're not anybody's compared to the well, people Well, no, there. You, you got an RFID chip going in here saying that you're with the Azkaban? Azkaban? No, not Azkaban. That's actually group people. Um, the Azkaban Council is basically all the people is as, like, the Native Americans in... Alaska and some of the in, in Canada. And then like the Chris and the Dementors. Uh. Shoo 
people are a, the Astarashi Corporate Council of Kansai. That sounds better. That so, sounds better. So that's who you people are. So here, like, good, good to hear from my good friends in Kansai. I, I haven't seen as much business this week, but I've heard good things. Like, he's got a little guy next to him. Like, there's a, there's a you standing next to him. Like, constantly, like, moving data around. And basically, he's constantly getting a, a live updated I, AR. So, like, there's a what team. What does that guy look like? Um. Yeah. <laughs> um. Walt Walker. What does Walt look like? Because <laughs> he's actually a person. Oh, yeah, he's a person. Ooh, make a friend. Together, we'll hack that website. Yeah. <laughs> um. He looks like a much put upon aid, honestly. But he's got his com link, and he's constantly, and you see him like he's got little twitchy hand movements because this is him moving around mm -hmm. the data that isn't is not going back and forth, but it's like little small ones because. He sees who you people are before you get there, and he's already folded it up and made it quick. Like, and we're trying to find out what way he's going to vote and if how, how not the right way, come. sway him. Yeah. Well, it's... So when John Boehner puts a vote before Congress, he basically knows how it's going to Okay? Like, that's his job. They, he, don't, they generally don't put up a vote unless they know they're gonna, it's going to go the yep. way they want. And so you can do all kinds of behind the scenes shit he votes you don't want to have happen not happen so he basically is controlling this vote so he unless somebody made a stake and brought it to there he made he already knows which way it's going to happen and he knows what way will end better for his the people he represents which is some of the triple a's around here you know Ren Raku is pretty close to him right now everyone likes Ren Raku um what do you guys want to do? Yeah, well, just that guy. We pretty much got to woo him in a way well, to get on his good side, don't we? Well, it depends. Let's see. Uh, intimidation probably won't work. Negotiations. <laughs> Where's Khan? Do you want to try to hack a Khan? No, not hack Khan's not your best. I'd okay. probably just try and negotiate with him to get it. Let's go buy him a drink. Um, yeah. I got the perfect thing. <laughs> 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 We, we don't want him unconscious. Um, He's like, what is this? He like, it's basically an A-bomb on Nakasaki. Like, that's what that is. I'm just gonna, like, send him my, like, my phone number or whatever. You're gonna make then friends? If you're ever not so busy, give me a single. You know, give me, give me, um, a charisma contract. I'm gonna use charisma, but I want to use, um, something to do with my computer skills as well because that's how awesome I am. Alright, if you want to use emoji to impress me. <laughs> <laughs> I will seduce you with emoji. <laughs> a lost art. <laughs> it's like our modern day holographic. <laughs> uh, I'll uh, negotiate with the speaker, I guess. Okay. Has uh, everyone been failing at this? No, they haven't. Even, they've been. They gotten close, and I'm just kind of explaining how government works. It doesn't work. <laughs> yeah. Is that okay? All right, you've made a little bit of a. Here, do it. Five, six, seven, eight. Check that one. Yeah, okay, so eight hits. All right, eight. Um, here. Yeah. So he'll he'll like shake your hand. Once again, once again, good to see you, my friends yeah. from Astasashi. Yeah. Um, you do raise some excellent points, by which further debate is warranted and extremely justified. And I'm in the in my opinion likely to generate the results that will provide both crucial um to to future action. Thank you for that. And turns away from. <laughs> Was there any role possible to get the information? He, he's a professional politician. So like, 
He probably likes Double to talk. drink. <laughs> well, he, he's got, so what he likes to do is not say anything. Because that way, he, if he doesn't say anything, he's obviously on your side all the time. Shook Khan into thinking we were. Oh. Uh, I have a question. Yeah. Uh, Alright, hey, I'm going to do a candle matrix search and just find out where he's staying. Yeah. Eight, nine. Okay, so this doesn't work out. We're really, go to Plan B. <laughs> Me and the orc are going to try some our stealth skills with stealing it. information because I hate you also. All right, what's the nature of this building? Sorry. Um, basically, it there it's. You guys never even asked that question. Oh. By the way, we're, we're awesome. Wait, well, we don't care. Or look it up on my com link. Uh, we'll, we'll kind of, uh, um, trying to, try to be a You you can easily look it up. It's it's some of that publicly available information. Yeah, doing that. Um, this bill is all about um six seven building a um a high speed railroad from the uh, the Renraku Oncology Arcology in London to um. Uh, the downtown just downtown London. Okay. Basically, it's high speed transportation. Uh, is yeah. it um, a lot of people for it, or right there? Yeah. 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 You're you're gonna figure that out. I mean, Public. there's no even Public. like. I, I um, it would be good for the Red Rocks people. But beyond that, no one knows anything. I, I forget what's in our ecology. Our ecology is a giant building where you can be born, live, and die working for only one company. Oh, it's a uh, in in. If you ever see like yeah, yeah, yeah. Seattle's yeah. skyline, skyline, there's a giant pyramid. That is the Renraku on our college. Yes. Yeah. It houses. In London? What? Another one in London? Yes. Uh, there's they there are like basically you could be born, go to kindergarten for Renra in Renraku, never have to go outside, live your entire life working for the company. Fourteen. It's a little ugly room. What are you looking for? Look, look. I was looking for or, uh, that where he, the uh, speaker is okay. staying. What's it? 1020? Is it 10, 10 Downing Street? Every Wait. every London child will know this. 221 Downing Street? No. No, this is at 221 B. This is 10 Downing Street. 10 Downing Street is where the Prime Minister was. I did not know that. Yeah. Well, it's that's good for nothing. Yeah, it's kind of like. Um, 14, is it 14? I'm pretty aware of it. So, no, is it 14? Basically, uh, the, the address of the White House is like 1480. Oh, don't think it's in the White House. Huh? Or, not the White House. Either way, there is a there is a number designation that will be... Odds of security. How good is security there? We need a hooker. <laughs> we need a hooker. Yeah, a I, saw, I saw that movie with Wesley Snipes. That's how that worked, right? <laughs> Kill somebody in the way Awesome. Uh, excuse me, Mr. Speaker. I'm a. It's gonna be great. I wouldn't <laughs> say I'm a lustrous, but I'm a well earning uh, restaurant owner, owner and uh, flat owner in um, uh, over in the colony, all over the states. I was wondering um, what the would be says. I was wondering if you might give me a, a, a good location where I might be able to. I'm thinking about opening up like a deli or a restaurant in here. I think you could. Wondering if you could give me a good location where I can get like a lot of people that are coming out of the or a lot of uh, a lot of travelers. Have you asked Representative Taylor Court? He is fascinated by that sphere of inquiry. My egg can, I'm sure, delineate more. Thank you. And he turns away from you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, this guy's not talking to anyone. He's so professional. Professional double talker. Yeah. He yeah, knows I, how to put I you down and politics. deny you without you even knowing. Yeah. Uh, how many people does he have working for? Or well, right now, well, uh, I mean, this whole room is basically working for Well, I, I get that by my anyone close. Um, is there is a, there is his, um, by the way, is when you when he's done talking to you, when you are done talking to you, you see a little A turn to you, and he shoots at you a little arrow that says, Vote Hughes! 
and then she shoots one at you both. So basically, he's like throwing like sticker, like the little buttons on people, oh. except they're <laughs> augmented reality <laughs> objects. So you get little buttons that appear in your per- in your in Matrix persona <laughs> that say "Vote Addison Hughes." And like, Vote Addison Hughes. <laughs> and so apparently, that's what it's his smiley face. I, I'm gonna sneak. Delete. I'm on Delacorte. is just a random, like, different so aid. No, it's basically like, oh, he's a representative. He's he's a speaker in this group, but he, he has no more power than anyone else. It's kind of like if uh, Boehner might ask you to go talk to Ted Cruz, because Ted Cruz heads up um, scientific fund. I still right like there. the hooker idea. Okay, like sneaking through hits. And he he knows I'm with everyone else, right? Yeah, they, like one. you all have this little yeah. RFID tag that represents you. We all represent that you're doing a great job. I, I, representing hey, the company. I, I, I haven't puked yet. <laughs> I haven't puked yet. You're not yet. trying hard enough. <laughs> I, I deleted mine. Okay, you can, you can do it right. You can like, pick yeah. it up. You and no, like very stealthily leave it. <laughs> Oh, look, it fell off. Yeah, so augmented yeah, reality, digital objects <laughs> fell off. <Yeah. laughs> <laughs> I, 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 I don't know, it's weird too. <laughs> I mean, we're just ding. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's the it's augmented reality, so it's fake. It's like, yeah. Why not? You just flick it and then just That's my daughter, that's that you, by the way. Uh, that's Pippin. She's trying to put this ball in my uh, shoe. Okay. Isn't your foot in it? Yeah. Um, let's see, so we need to talk to that guy. What's that guy's name? Yeah, he flipped the thing onto us to vote for? Uh, Addison Hughes is the speaker. Oh, okay. Basically, he's telling yeah. you to vote for him. Does he have, can we find out if he has, like, some type of an assistant of any? Yeah, right next to him is this little, um... How old is she? Walker. Walter Walker. She, um, he. is a year old. Yeah, no, it's not quite the assistant. He looks like a must-put-upon... Um, a so basically, there's there's this kind of he doesn't look dapper. He looks like a like he's been overworked, and his whole job is basically like when he talks to anybody, to he will flip like virtual note cards to him so he can have a quick conversation with you about whatever the hell you're interested. In. So when like the head of Renrock who talks to him, he'll be feeding him all this information so he can constantly stay in the conversation and it make it appear like the guy has studied for years. That's our key right there. Well, yeah, no, that's why I was just wondering, where does that guy live? <laughs> <laughs> where is he, Pippin? Same location. <laughs> no, he probably wouldn't live at the same location, but he would live at a secure location. Oh. Uh, like, this, like, it's kind of like the, this would be like the, in the president's cabinet. So, like, where, where does Hillary Clinton live? Kind could I uh, ask him the if thing? they'd like me to buy a round for him and his uh, entourage? Uh, yep, like when you were talking, when you actually talk to this, I, since this is all free, I think I'm okay. Uh, I do appreciate Oh, is it free? Yeah, this whole, this whole thing is like, you went up there, he gave you a free drink. You should probably have another you ride. open <laughs> bar? No one told me this. <laughs> 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 no! I I'm like, you know, I'm like this is, you're, you're speaking to the president, you're like, wait, this is an open <laughs> bar? <laughs> John, I'm getting wrecked! He's like, <laughs> who's that guy I just paid money to? <laughs> <laughs> I like this. I'm going to get wrecked up in here. That's <laughs> 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 Well, did you find it? So what do you want to do next? Um. Hmm. Uh, uh, Bad dog. Bad dog. <laughs> no, I said ah, dog. Okay, how, we need to figure out a way to separate the assistant from... Let, let's try, not try separating. Let's just try, at least just distract it. Uh, can the real deck? Can I assist the real decker in uh, hacking this guy? Yeah. If you want to ask the decker to throw some, you could try marking up the um, the assistant. <laughs> let me let me assist you first. I can do a uh, well, do just do one roll to assist her. And how many hits they get? How many extra dice you get? No, it's kind of just her all by herself. Yeah, it's, oh. mo- it's more like a hack rather than a oh, okay. test. So I can't. Assist. Okay. Are you doing the stealthing? Stealthily. Of course. You think so you're going to be like, BAM! I'm going to touch him in his brain! <laughs> Do you think he would notice his assistant missing? 
probably. <laughs> all of a sudden, it's like he's he's getting all these texts like, oh, it's good to me- nice to meet you, Mr. Rockwell. Here about all your, oh my God, help me, help me. <laughs> I'm being murdered in the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> he's just like, like, he's been pooping a long time. <laughs> 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 so, are you okay in there? I've already tried to talk to him, and he was like, yeah, go away. <laughs> Um, if you want to, you can try, um... Can I invite a mark? I, uh, uh, mm-hmm. what, you, you want to have him mark you? Yeah. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> you can. Uh, Are you trying to, like, uh, pot him into the bathroom? <laughs> <laughs> Suck your dick. It doesn't even well, say well, dick, it has the little, go. it's the eight equal, 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 equal D. <laughs> 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 that just pops up in his augmented reality. I'm probably never going to be here again, so why not? Nice. <laughs> See, that's why I went, to, hey, I went to the bar for that exact reason. Um, Alright, well, let me... Uh, you're going back to the bar, aren't you? Open bar, man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to earn this time, Graham. Zane. If we do, we have a perfect 19. He, uh, I'm wild card, he's man. straight, so that works. Um, <laughs> what? Did you, you ever see Sunny in Philadelphia? What? You ever see Sunny in Philadelphia? Oh, jeez. I'm Charlie. I'm oh, wild card. Fuck. On this one. <laughs> no, I, I'm taking it. Beautiful. Uh, um... Not sunny in Philadelphia. It's, uh, uh, okay, uh, like so that he doesn't in mark you. You can try to mark him. Though. Mm-hmm. No, he does not mark that. Called. California Nation. Oh, um, that's exactly the bald one. So. Rumple. Charlie Rumple. Yeah. yeah. You mark him. Uh, I, I the other marker is coming. I started watching it. So it like you want to explore his like data? I'm just going to be like, oh, just one more? what the hell? Yeah, you can. Uh, that's all the time. I really like it. Yeah, it's like, I guess it was, I think I was on the season four or five. I haven't watched it in a while. I always like watching um, it. Um, give me a, um, give me a, um, give me a, Perception plus intuition test. Matrix perception or yeah, perception matrix perception. perception, matrix perception. Is, is there like plus a what? Like matrix perception plus intuition. Hey, where is matrix perception by the way? It should. I'll be in your. Uh, it's under computer. Yeah. Help computer. Help <laughs> computer. I can't. I can't get up. You're such a young one. <laughs> So, matrix perception normally is uh, logic or... Oh, you can do logic. That's fine. They told me one thing, and um, some of this is, was, was made when they were first making the system. It might be intuition. It is intuition. Ten. Ten, twelve, yards. Ten, two, three, four. Okay. This takes a bit of time, by the way. So you're, like, in the bathroom for, like, an hour. No, it's just like the Does she have to be in she's, in the, she's in the women's bathroom. Well, she's no. passed out. She went full VR. Oh, yeah. Like she's she in like a stall. So yeah. Like yeah. She's like. <laughs> I'll sure, yeah, that on the other side. <laughs> With an open bar. Mid. Mid. She put it like the website. So let's say you have an hour, but you're able to find um, a video um, that Walt recorded, and it shows. Um, Basically, him meeting with a bunch of uh, other members of Congress and the, or other members of Parliament, and the vote happens, and they basically it's it's been uh, it's down to it's even Steven. Yeah, that's why they want to. That's where Van Yes. So in, in the case of a tie, Whatever. in the case of a tie. Um, the speaker gets the vote, and the speaker was so one of the votes. So it's a vote, so it won't be a tie. It won't be a tie. Ah. So with housing dead, the speaker would get to the side. Yes. Ah. But you don't know if housing is dead. Uh, oh, and okay. we still have to figure out which side he's going to pick. Send me a message. Send me a message? Help me. Send me a message. Like, how's it going? 
found anything new. Can I try and, uh, well, <laughs> half an hour or you, you know it. Like, what, you're out there smoothing with a guy, and he's like, yes, it's good, it's good, good yeah. to see you with double speak. Oh, you at Loot Crate. Yeah, I did. You need to get your ass on Thursday. Down here. Sure. Well, uh, like I said, Sundays and Thursdays are always hard days. But, uh, oh, I can help you make a character see if you're interested. Um. I don't know what type of character I'd be. I'd probably do brute. No, be you, you basically... You can always be a half-orc barbarian. Do you have a search for anything related to housing in particular? Maybe. That's what he Maybe just did. Maybe a dragon more than a barbarian. I should go dragon more. You do, yeah, I'll let you do another search. It's a big idea. After no, this probably works, Jacko. I haven't kept track of your... Let's get characters are magical, aren't they? They're kind of magical, aren't they? Uh, not really, but... Do you want to be magical? No. Alright. I don't like magical characters. A dragon more is basically like a dragon that fails to be a dragon. They haven't so really like heard much from him in a real So he's already time. off not, you know, being um, like, successful. Uh, what? <laughs> so he's pretty here? just not off to a good not start. Really. Already failed at becoming a dragon. Really it's so more like a genetic thing. Yeah. I'm gonna jack out the, the whole lore so thing is that like dragon more than a dragon. We can wake up from the bathroom. Go to a different stall, pass out. Stall hopping, it works. I would do that. That's new though. That's new. Is that you, by the way? It's not new, but it's just new lore to it. Okay, That's funny though. Do you uh, send me this information or no? I'll send everybody. Alright. Now, I'm going to retry that whole uh, software on that uh, on that uh, picture because my detective senses are tickling. It is pants. Ew, giggity. <laughs> is in my pockets. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't heard that one in a while, actually. <laughs> oh, that was like, it was just everywhere. Nope, just in his pants. <laughs> <laughs> well played. Well played, good man. Yeah, touche. <laughs> Alright, three hits. Still nothing. Yeah, that was exactly what you had before. No, I had one hit. Oh, okay, before. well, that's what you had before. Yeah, I'm not giving up. Uh, I'm not, that's super, I'm so glad you're not getting it. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, how long would it take to get to this guy's place? Uh, you, well, it's right now, you guys got there at 7 o'clock. It's probably closer to 10 now after whining and dieting. I've only had one shot. <laughs> Time travel! <laughs> <laughs> um, I got five hits. And she spent an hour in the bathroom. Uh, about five hits. You can't, did you spend another hour? Yeah. So it's like, it's midnight now. No, it's midnight. not, not hour, hour, hour. It, it takes a while to do digital reconstruction. Well, qu well Chris, spending time for the rest of us. <laughs> <laughs> right, go, go, go. Go enjoy the party. Um, <laughs> go enjoy the party, you babies. How long will it take to get to this guy's house? Cause not that long. Like 30 minutes an hour? Probably 30 minutes, yeah. All right, so I'm going to come say, all right, we're not doing anything here. So me and your ugly mug are going to go check out the Sir Guy's house. The me? Fortress? You. You hate me. I do hate you. But you're just as useless as I am here. <laughs> I, I really was about to go do something party. in the bathroom, okay? <laughs> go to the bathroom. Going to no. The <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to try and go <laughs> to the fortress. Yeah, yeah. I'll go with him. Yeah. Except yes. every insult yep. I get on the way there. Yeah. I, I'm Park Decker. We got no magic skill. Let's do this. <laughs> <laughs> you don't have to have a magic. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have a deck or know how to use computers. What? I don't have a deck or know how to use computers. Can you just play Yakety Sax in the background? Yes! <laughs> <laughs> you know that Yakety Sax? I, I probably have heard of Oh, you're such a youngling! The Benny Hill... Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Kind of look. Um, oh, you're so goddamn young. Oh, that's so right. Benny Hill. I had no choice to be born in '92. I know, but so Benny Hill is. Yeah, you're like, on the meme. There's oh. kind of like two big things that brought British culture to America. There's a bunch of things, but two big comedy things that I've. Seen. There's Monty Python, <laughs> mm -hmm. and then there's Benny Hill. They're kind of polar opposites. Monty Python is about as British humor as you get. It's kind of dry sometimes, like this paradise. I've only seen Holy Grail. You, you should. Then we can have the quotes. 
Uh, <laughs> I have seen. Uh, so you've so only seen the Holy Grail? Mm -hmm. Oh, you only. Okay, yeah. good. We can have the quote set. That's but, pretty iconic. That's pretty iconic. Yeah. So, it's, it, but there's like a lot of British humor. Like, what is your favorite color? I don't know. Oh, oh, like, that. like, okay, that made fuck all sense. But yeah. It's too big. She won't eat the it. other one is Benny Hill. Benny Hill was kind of an older. He's an older guy, and his shows typically were a bunch of little skits. They do. There was always boobs. There was always boobs on there because it's it's instead of like being iconic British comedy, it's more here is um, some lowbrow. Everyone enjoys the humor. Yakety Sax is they play this like there'll be some like Benny will do something that'll piss somebody off. Like he'll go in the wrong bathroom and some scanner fat girl will come out and she'll start hitting him with a hitting him with a purse. Then he'll start running around to somebody else. So this other person will follow him. And there'll be this giant, like, conga line of people trying to beat on Benny Hill as he runs around. And, like, he'll end up running into, like, the little changing houses on the beach. And he'll be in there, think everyone will run past. He'll get out. And then a guy will step out of there who thinks he's kind of cute. And like, oh, crap. So that'll take off. And that's Benny Hill. It's lowbrow humor. Her family grew up listening to more, like, like the highbrow British what about, humor. What about Mr. Bean? Mr. Bean, he's probably, what do you think? He's... I mean, his is kind of physical comedy, but it's more clean. Benny Hill is more risque. Yeah. For, especially for the time, because it was like the 70s. So, like, to have little chicks in, like, French made outfits running around was more like. Yeah. That's more Benny Hill style. But that's what I grew up. She grew up on the highbrow, I grew up on the low. <laughs> it's on yeah, yeah, amongst a lot of things. But yeah, I'm well, no, sure. no. If you get if you get a chance, like this is now it's like oh, what are we? Well, there's a girl in a bikini. Why do we care? Yeah. But back in the it was the seventies. Like, oh my god. Pretty much same thing with like Betty Page back in those days. Betty Page was awesome. Anyway, um, so are you just gonna leave the rest of the group? Hey, like, here's the thing. Going. You like you we're can going. all like text people. Like you could yeah, you can communicate with us. Mm -hmm. Yeah, easily. like yeah. well, well, she's out there hacking his comic like, and stuff. You could be like, we're gonna run off, BRB. Like, yeah, well, that's going to the castle. That, that's basically what we're doing. Awesome. Yeah. Okay, these guys drinking him. <laughs> we're ready. You're twelve. No, no, You're different 12. character. <laughs> <laughs> different character. Thirty-four. Try again. Awesome. Okay. Good. Okay. So. Come here. I'm you down. guys make your way out there, I'm the rest down. of the people at the party. Pollution Biscuit Oaks hey, skirt the patch of grass upon which the housing estate sits. No one tra uh, no one traffics the white gravel road through the wrought iron gates. Ringed by low stone wall, sandbag bunkers have been constructed inside the four corners. Visored Visor guards scan the estate and surroundings from their fortified posts. They appear vigilant despite the late hour. Some exterior lights are on to make the place look normal to passers by, but there are no lights in the house itself. Okay. What is? Can I do something? Sure. I want to contact this lady. Okay. Ask for some help with that video. All right. Um. Tell you what. I'll let you add your appropriate. I'll let you add your software skill, and she can roll connection and loyalty. <coughs> so, you add so take four plus five, four plus one. Plus five. Whatever. With four plus four plus one plus your software. Dice or dice. Key, okay. Well, actually, add your logic because it's so software and logic. Well, just just add your logic. Then she's going to use her connection and her loyalty to work for you. She's also got the cracking group skill. That means she can do it. Like you're calling in a favor from a friend. And usually when you ask a connection to do something, you add your, your own charisma to it. But this is not the same thing. You're asking for a friend to help with your yep, computer. Yeah, yeah, so throw it. I'm making sure that you go. And and well, she's uh, doing that. Can I see if there's any codes or anything that yeah. yeah, you can. Yeah. Alright. So. Do I get to make a extended search or just straight white roll? Uh, just do a straight roll for a matrix perception. Okay. Uh, All that. Uh, this stinks. No, it's what you know. 
Um, you reveal the both those are empty, by the way. No, they're both empty. You learn that the wet spot looks to be a bite wound. Are you talking to me or him? Uh, you. You you have gone through and figured out uh, that the wet spot bite. appears to be a bite wound, and the um, you can confirm that the figure's face is Lord James Helping. Hmm. What do you mean? Um. You're not able to tell. Like it only shows the door of the building. So you're, you're kind of looking for... Like location not really. Like you basically got like a grainy, crappy... Bite a bite mark on his arm. Um, you know, if you want to, you can loan me logic plus para biology. Yeah, that's the only <laughs> thing that I have. I'm pretty sure. Um, so I, guess I believe he has information it. With him. Well, I'm not sure. I'm not certain. <laughs> <laughs> No, I'm magical creature. Do you have parabiology or magical creature? Both. Okay. Alright, so. Okay. What'd you get? Oh, me. Five hits. Five hits? I'll let you have this. This is pretty obscure. Um, it looks to be about a people sized what bite wound. Stand here. No, it's not on the neck, it's on the arm. So well, not all that here is on the neck. So it like if it, it like, could range a from a virtual easily work. Yeah, but it's on his arm. Like somebody took it to bite out of his up here. Uh, so like that could be um like there's a lot of things like somebody crazy could bit him all the way to him being bitten by a ghoul. By what? A ghoul. An HPM string. The first so there was a big when the world ended for fifth to sixth. India had a massive plague happen, and it wiped out about a quarter of the world's population. Okay, along the way, they also discovered something called the HVMM, human metahuman uh, vampiric virus. The most common thing that happens is we have people become ghouls. They become magically awakened, and they have to eat metahuman or human flesh. And they also go blind. They become blind to the real world, but they get astral sight. So they can see people's light signatures. Um, but they can't read anymore because, look, this is just going to appear gray because it's not alive anymore. But you can actually get cyber eyes putting a ghoul it, in their it, pocket. It's kind of like, <laughs> it kinda like becomes um, a uh, um, thermal sight like, that, like this thing is used to more accurately sense your prey. It's more like a hunting mechanism. So, what you you've seen him come out of, out of somewhere shady, in you know with a bite, which well, is not good. We did. Well, you guys have video. If you are, if so, all of you like she could be slumped in the bathroom right now. So I can still con. I can still communicate. Like, she'd actually be moving like at hyper mouse speed because she's moving like three, four times as fast as people do that. So she could be just constantly shooting you all this in information. Matrix, yeah. Not in like her, she she's moving at the speed of thought right now. You're all just getting like live feed. Yeah. So she'll go glass. She's eating that. I don't even get that. One. What is she eating now? Fuck her. Here's some taco beefs. Um, taco beefs. What? Yeah. That's what. Oh, like two bits to see about finding those. Taco Bell? Yeah. To see about finding those. Have you been to Taco Bell lately? I don't remember. Because <laughs> I don't think I have. It sounds kind of tasty now that I think about it. I've never... Like, I, I was going to go there after we left. <laughs> <laughs> um, it is down the street. You are able to see that there is a note. Um, so you can see that the the housing estate has a... Uh, does have a, a note to it. Okay. Alright, so try and take it what we're doing. Um, well, there's we'll two mark. ways to do it. There's two ways to mark a node. This is going to be awesome. The first way you can mark a node is um, hard and fast. We go in loud, you use, uh, is it 
a half of a fly? A mark, yeah. Well, there's two ways to do it. There's what there's attack and sleeves. Um, what what is hacking and logic? I did a hack on the fly one, so I'm not. So if you want to be quiet, it's hacking plus logic, um. limited by your sleeve action. Do you have do you have a pop, do you have a um a deck? A deck? Uh, see, like a, I'm still. I made this character now. I'll show you. No, no, can I see this character? <laughs> Go ahead. Well, you you don't want one of those. No, no, no. If, if you're not going to hack people, you don't want a deck. Okay. Um, Did what? your deck a uh, hack from a that, not Oh, you're a technomancer. Yeah. Oh, okay. See that? I'm, I'm sorry, but no, that's, that's fine, because I'm like... Then we have to throw out some things that I just said. Okay. You are your own deck. Yeah. All right, so we don't need a deck. Yes. Technomancers are the otaku. They're people who can go on the internet with just their brain. Yep. They can what? They can go on the internet with just their brain. But however, like she can say, I'm going to go AR, or just kind of like lean back and like Google Glass pops stuff up, and I'm like, yeah, I'm, I'm completely paying attention to you as I'm watching like ultra porn. Um, <laughs> that, that can happen. Mm -hmm. He, on the other hand, like, yeah, I'm completely he's gone. But he also be doing shit with him when he's like. <laughs> <laughs> hey, we all gotta have. We, we all we, 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 don't you fucking touch me. <laughs> <laughs> We're about to go out for about five minutes. Don't you touch me. <laughs> um, what? So what you do? You basically will pass out all the way. Okay. Um, you will use your charisma. A foot parse. That's the one I did. Well, no. There's two ways to do this. Okay. All right. There is. Um, the two ways that you can do this, because right, you so get you got a reading assignment. One by the book. Well, that's on order. Yeah, I know, but I'm yes, telling sir. I'm just telling you this now because you, you download the book, right? Sure. Yeah, I gave it to you. Yeah, so now I'll be able to read it. Yep, yep, yep. But I still want I I'm not going to give away this. Of like course. even you have it, I prefer if you buy it. Like I'm not going to say like, oh yeah, you got to completely buy this. If I could afford it, I would. What are you right now? I mean, for money. Hmm? What do you do for money now? I'm basically like a janitor. Ah. Uh, what do you work? It's a country market in Brooklyn. Oh. That's not bad. Well, it is. What? It is. Well, money, money. Yeah, money, money, but it's still very low money. So, there's two ways you can do this, okay? Okay. You can roll um, charisma plus. Um, Hacking. That's not hacking. Or you can roll logic. Okay. Or in intuition. Okay. Plus software. Of course. That really sounds right. It, in intuition, it hacking. I uh, know hacking plus logic is. Oh, I guess you. It would just be um. Hacking plus intuition. Hacking plus intuition. Uh, I can do that one. Alright. So let me let me tell you something, okay? Right. You are your you over there. She is a deck. Okay. She has a box that we put in her brain. It's about this big. We shoved it in there. Okay. And she basically thinks with it. And that's how you use it. Um this oh, is her current com like in the current deck. Okay? You cannot hack it. Like, the world does not function like that stupid hacking game where you have a cell phone and just get Watch people... Dogs. Yeah. Doesn't work that way. Your standard off-the-shelf phone will do that. Are you kidding me? This thing has a data processing and a firewall attribute. That, that's what the numbers mean. So data processing, firewall. Data processing is how well I can Google. How fast can I find my porn? Firewall is how well will that protect me? You need um, data. Sorry, decks have two attributes. They have hack or they have attack and sleeps. Okay, and if, and if you look at, I yeah, know that they have the t they have two attributes. So attack, sleeves, firewall, data pressing, ASDF, just like your just like your standard keyboard mm -hmm. letters. Um, you, the techo, techno boy, these are your four attributes, okay? okay? So his brain makes his own deck for him. 
they're extremely rare because no one knows what the fuck they are. Because they can they can hack and some people don't trust them. There's actually been some movements against technomancers. Yeah, they've, they've been prosecuted. Yeah. Persecuted. Dad. <laughs> Come on, Captain Penetry. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not kind of Captain Penetry. I admit when I'm wrong. You still don't know what penetry means. All right. So. Well, you, um, instead of having, like, the deck stats, end. you use your own stuff, okay? Cool. So, you want to move those around where you need to be. Alright. So, you, roll me those two. So, what was it, intuition and, uh... Intuition plus hacking, if you got it. I have hacking. Hacking. Alright, so you should roll. I'm going to tell you right now, you probably want to edge that. Once you go right to edge afterwards. Um, what's your edge attribute right now? Um, what is you, it? Did you say four? Two. Two? Yeah. What? Um, you, yeah, you know what, maybe you edge after. <laughs> God damn it, edge is one of the most important things in the game. I, I, and I burnt my only one doing shit. <laughs> <laughs> this is why I have fucking seven edge. <laughs> Six Put it this way. You oh, I know are like one like your lucky bug. No, I know what it is. But you have marked <laughs> the Helsing Estate server. <laughs> it is a rating eight host. <laughs> <laughs> I just got a boner. <laughs> I just got a boner. <laughs> 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 well, good. Would you yeah. like to walk inside of the the? Yeah, we'll, we'll go this nice and slow. I'm, I'm not gonna try to summon any toast here. Well, no. If you you if you you it, it, you're allowed to be in there. If you don't, if you do anything stupid, then stuff happens. Yeah. So I'm stupid disappointed. All right. Okay. You know you're hanging out with, right? So uh, I do, unfortunately. Um, stupid is not business. If you see <laughs> black, I just run away. <laughs> Yeah, um, cool. Yeah, you open it up, and you walk into an Eastern-style opium den. Yay! How, how very, uh, oh, what's it called? Uh, reminiscent of the man. Um, yeah, um, uh, uh, old school. so yeah, this guy is, um, You are able to open up, and it looks like an eastern style opium den. Okay. Um, anything in there that I can look at without stepping on toes, or? Yeah, there's, um... Opium den, you mean the drug, right? Yeah, opium the drug. Okay. Sweet. In, uh, back in, like, at... I need to call my, my ganger buddies and I need to raid this place. <laughs> back in the um, 19th century, uh, there was a lot of opium dens in London itself. Yeah, um, year, do you want to, okay. And whose place is this? The, the uh, guy, James. The guy making the main decision. James Helsing. He snap some photos. Mm. He's got some proof of this. Um. Uh, blackmail him. Oh, God. <laughs> so, do you want to do a bump? Yeah. Um. Not in there only here. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, well, I mean, let me read through really quick because I'm seeing sure. how you can do this. Um, just don't play it like that game last night where you're like, okay, here's the, uh, here's what you're doing. Hit these triggers. Hit these triggers. <laughs> what? Uh, you missed uh, the zombie game last night. Just trying to survive. Oh, that was fun. Yeah, it was fun. Um, I killed four people and we lost four morale thanks to uh, Mike, right? God damn it. He, he killed two of his party guys right in a row. Well, not right in a row. At the very beginning of the game, he lost his two guys, got the dog, and then came back oh, with yeah, five yeah. party members. Yeah, yeah. And, then, and then later on, he moved two of his guys to the same location. First guy made it fine. Second person... Uh, got died, then killed the other one. We went down to one round. 
And then I, yeah, this is a fun game. What game was this for? Like doing it. What? What game was this for? Dead of where? No idea. It was fun. You need to show up on Thursday. <laughs> Thursday, we play board games, then do shit, and then we do D. On it, uh, in Dead of Winter, it's a <laughs> cooperative game where we're all trying to survive the winter with the undead. The problem is, one person may be a traitor. You don't know. Does it get assigned at the beginning? What hap- yeah, you take you take 11 mystery goals, you take 10 mystery personal goals, take one traitor card, mix them in, Hand out five. I'm intrigued. And then we all have one overall goal. It's like, oh, we need to get enough medicine to survive the winter. And then the one person knows that they're the traitor. They know it, but the rest of us don't know. Also, every turn there's a bad thing that happens. You have to put X number of cards down on it. On each player's turn, there's a personal trigger in which fun stuff can happen. Yeah, like one, my one guy, I got a guy who's a truck driver. And the next person, he's like, I pick up his card because the person to your right reads, has your card. And if X trigger is happening, stuff happens. So it's like, okay, is Rod in the game? My guy is. He says, oh. So as soon as he starts, he's like, well, I'm going to. I'm like, wait. Rod grabs his, grabs the chest and begins to think to himself, oh God, oh God, it's better than the zombies. Oh God, oh God. I'd rather die from truck store or truck stop um, uh, mac and cheese. He falls to the ground, twitching, feeling the coldness spread through his chest. Uh, another survivor says, I think I saw a, uh, a defibrillator in the hospital, but it's going to take time to drag him out there. Option A. Select two survivors in the colony, drag and rob, bring them to the um, host- hospital. And every character must make two survival checks. Option B, kill Rod. If Rod dies, you lose one morale. If, but two survival checks might kill people. So the whole game is like knife edge, like, oh my god, what do we do? Uh, what happens if your character dies, though? If you, you die, you draw a new character. Go so Drake, friends. They don't get to live anymore. Yeah. So, um, you, you, I'll give you the layout of this place. Okay. Um, there is a wine cellar off to one side. Um, it has a door outside. Um, there is a central air shaft with a elevator in it. And there are rooms spread around this central air shaft. Um, uh, you are amazing. On the... Um, Pippin, stop. S- on the second floor of the building... Wait. You will know um, off the center Stop. central chamber is Lord Helsing's private chamber, where he would cast his votes from. There are no internal security keys. No internal security keys. Okay. If I, if uh, I can I see if there's anything like uh, main security, like uh, turrets or anything? It's not possible to see that without getting more marks. So. Uh, no, you can. You basically can go. You're you're walking through this opium den, and you pull a book off the shelf, and it'll say like. Um, facilities. You can pick it up quality. and open it up and it'll be, it opens like a Skyrim book. Okay. Where you flip it open and words appear right. and you flip it open and you can make it as big or as small as you want. Because mm-hmm. it looks like something like sometimes it'd be like, oh this is a wizard's tower. You get a scroll and you open it up and it'll be like a full motion video. And right. 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 Um, you open it up and it's like there, there are no internal security. Um, the only security outside is these guards. So get past the guards and it's only the people with well, there's nothing connected to the nose. There's no security on the nose. I'm sure we got our weapons. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we're, we're weaponized. Definitely. Okay. Thing is, I'm be- the best weapon I have is my unarmed combat. That's the funny thing. Can I say something? Mm-hmm. Is there any like actual cameras that in his study or are they just all turned off? There are you. There are no cameras inside. Okay. The you do see that there are there are powers. The um. His voting terminal is currently powered up. Okay, uh, to look at that one, we need to make additional calls. Well, it's, it's like you can tell the, it's got power to it, but it's not hooked up. Which okay, that so is actually hooked, hooked up to um, the parliament note. Oh, I see. So okay. if you were to go mess with that, you'd be <laughs> like, let's, let's hack <laughs> England. Might let's notice that. Oh, <laughs> come on. I, I just got away with this one. Why not try another? Uh, <laughs> I, I, like I bet you I can hack England. <laughs> 
The highest it goes is rating 12? No. That's, is it 24? Okay. But that was oh, wow. Highest. Oh, that's way well, more. Well, that's when... That's, that's what like, she's going to hack. I'm going to go hack... I want to go hack... Um, A country. No. I was going to say, I'm going to go hack Ares. I bet you I can hack their big big head of office. You are eating my chew. Stop. Uh-oh. All right. So, since I'm not going to make an attempt to do that... uh. Do oh, we, are you guys going to try to sneak in? Uh, Before they um, do that in the whole world exposed, with the video that I saw, do I have enough information to pay off the guy and get our money for the first part of it? Do you want to call him? Uh, uh, what was the original? He just wants to know where the money is, right? He gave you a burn number yeah. if you wanted to talk to him and you could... And you could well, how are we supposed to the information back to him? Um, um, we got post ski or any um, uh, certain form yeah. on the on that climbing form. Yeah, so, so we don't really have enough yet. Cause and we're also not going to do that. Well, yeah. you might have enough. You know, if you, uh, uh, if uh, you think if you know that if nothing happens, down. the boat will fail. You also know that if you go to this place and get Lord Helsing to vote, you will the boat will pass. So, so let's yeah. just or it can fail. You can choose. We you can either get, we, we get 9,000 extra this way. Right. We, we don't really care how it goes, but we just need to Let, know let's what hold off okay. on I it. just didn't know if we should, um, if, if we had enough for his part. You probably have enough right now if you just wanted the post to be done. But I don't want to fuck up his whole plan, so. He doesn't have a plan. He just wants to know if he should or shouldn't have this real estate. I was pointing at him. He's basically an investor. He's trying to figure out how he and her Right. Okay. So then. Do you want to call him and talk to him? No, I'm not no. calling him. That was no, no. Yeah. Um. <laughs> let's see. You said that there was a shaft to the elevator, correct? Yeah. Well, yeah. On the second floor is um. Uh, how about can we like um search uh recent uh footage to try and find a good picture of him? That's the one. You guys have the last picture. Yeah. Yeah. No, from that software. That's, that's, that's the. Fight him, Pippin. Go for the throat like I taught you. <laughs> well, right. failing. So. I don't completely Small remember word. the uh, map layout. Word. Basically, it's a it's uh, off in the basement. There yeah. is a uh, here. I can get you. And if you can get me a uh, thing so I can look at real fast, because you can say it all, but here is um, okay. That's the first floor. Uh, all right, and his thing is on the second floor. Right? Uh, yeah, I will give you the. Calm down. That's the second floor. Mm-hmm. Storage area is chamber. Where's the elevator? Oh, no. In the central chamber that E is. Oh, the central in. chef. I see it now. I'm sorry. I'm That's <laughs> fine. He's got oh, kind no. of a cool future house where there, there's he's the, got an elevator. Oh, no. there's, a, that, that, there's that vent right there on the far side of the mm-hmm. storage. Okay. Oh, um, no. Is there access to the uh, vent? The exit still vent still on the roof, right? You, yeah, probably. If you want to try to climb up there. I'm thinking about, but would an orc fit? <laughs> Orcs aren't that big. Orcs are just <laughs> no, I, I know that. I'm just <laughs> the main <laughs> issue is trolls. <laughs> <laughs> no one likes trolls. Orc chain is horrible. So, um, also, uh, let's see the guards. But how how many guards are around? With you? Um, right, you you see a couple visor guards, you might be able to sneak. Do you want to make a sneak spell check? Let's just go in there in like John Wick style and just start murdering. Uh, you can! Sure. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> if, you have a, if you have a high powered sniper rifle, you give me a spell check. Uh, I I'll let you try to take somebody out. Uh, no. I'm better at punching, I guess. Um, how, how closely how are the guards? Because I got stick and shock. <laughs> uh, well, they're. Even better. They're. <sighs> like, you know at least there's three around. Three around, just. Just they've been patrolling and keeping the area. Just thing. moving the area around. Okay. Um. Uh, I have a question. Yes. What the hell is a street line special? It's a gun. It's a shitty little gun. It's like the one that we're shooting guns you can get. It's a holdout. Basically, if if shit hits the fan, you have a gun you can pull out. Like, like a prostitute gun. What? Right? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Actually, yeah, that, that's <laughs> too. Wait, one sec. I have an idea. Yeah, so. Uh, so depending on the prostitute, she might have a better gun. Yeah. If she's ready for this. Okay. No, it's just a high end. So, I have screamer arrow, arrows. Mm-hmm. I also have a bow. 
Would it be possible for me to uh, increase our odds by shooting an arrow to one side and we go into the other? No, transfer it onto them. I'll let you, if you, yeah, I'll let you, um... Yeah, this, won't this guy come home to his place and then find all his guards dead? No, no, we're not, we're, we're, we're trying to avoid... Oh, misdirect the guard. Correct. Screamer uh, arrow. Do you Probably have, um... Way. Roll yeah. me charisma plus yeah, your yeah. attack skill. Send him 500 oh. attacks. <laughs> charisma. Because <laughs> you're trying to bluff. Uh, I, I get it, I get it. Um, charisma S- and send plus him my five hundred skill. Ads. Send him 500 heads. <laughs> and then send him a thousand more. Uh, like, what the fuck? That's why he has to like, turn it off and then just turn it back on. Charisma plus my what skill? Your, the attack of the weapon skill. Alright, so. Uh, yeah, that'd be accuracy, correct? Yep. All right. not, not the accuracy. It'd be the skill. So bow would be the, oh, okay. I'm the sure. weapon skill. Accuracy is how well you can do. Eight. Eight on there. Alright, so I get eight. Plus charisma, uh, would uncouth or social stress affect this? Nope, not at all. Awesome. Then I get nine dice. Okay. Um. Oh wait, hang on a second. I'm sorry. You got <laughs> archery's added up together, so I'd actually only have three there plus my charisma. So that'd be four. That's a lot worse. What? Well, you only have one for charisma. Yeah. Alright, <laughs> let's try this. Guess what this orc has, Prisma? Yeah. Four. I could talk better than you. <laughs> You're still uglier than me. <laughs> um, let's see. Do I want to save it? I'll call it with one hit. Well, you beat my nun, so. Yay! Because they don't have, they do not have any um, nego- counter negotiations. I'm like, I guess they. <laughs> All right, so you shoot off. All right, they will go, like, one of the guards will go off toward the thing. So you guys have, you can run up to the building. Let's do this and get inside the building. All right, so you, we have the runners going in. How do you guys... This is a little tipsy. If you have it. What are you guys trying to do inside of here? Um, let's see. Hey. I don't think we even discussed it. <laughs> well, we're just going to get up to the computer. Uh, if the guy's alive, we can... Maybe trying to intimidate him, maybe kill him, who knows? Let's Which, do stuff. Are you, are you guys, where are you guys entering? Are you trying to enter through the main door? or uh, where, Where's the easiest access point? You, can we get There's a the front door. Are you just going up to the front door? Uh-huh. Well, you did see the wine cellar. Uh, would the wine cellar connect hey. on anything? Wine cellar. Me too. I'm with the drunken draw. Open <laughs> cellar, <laughs> man. This seems like a bad idea. No, but no, no, let's let's just just take, screw the mission. Yeah. Yeah. He ends up leaving. He, the guy comes back and just finds drunk work in his wine cellar. A really me. nice white soup. <laughs> yeah, so, to the wine cellar. Right. You're the one trying to offer me free beer and charge me for, for whatever. <laughs> you know, they might yeah, they'll actually be drunk enough to have them talk to the So. You guys go to the wine cellar. Yep. Okay. Um. We're grabbing a bottle. <laughs> I'm, gonna bring, I'm not drinking. I'm just carrying. Remember, I'm take from the one. top. It's a blunt <laughs> object. Remember, take from the top. Okay. okay. So, oh, the door to the wine cellar. You see that it it, it has a magna lock on it. Magna lock. Yes. Meaning it's a. Uh, it is locked. It's a magnetically sealed lock. We're going back out the wine cellar. Probably. Uh, electronically locked, correct? Or just. Yes, it's an electronic lock. Alrighty, then. then. Yay, yay. What would I use to quickly try to unlock it? Do you have cracking? Uh, cracking, cracking. Compiling computer, cyber combat, cyber technology, decompiling. Ah. I don't think so, I have. Do you have any, like, lock picking skill or no? I do not have lock picking, no. I'll let you try it. I'll let you roll cyber combat on it and try to pop it that way. Cyber combat works for me. You win. You pop the door open. Let's move on. You're lucky he's rolling bad. Um, okay, so, uh, 
Alright. Yeah, my guys supposed to be able to just do the basic stuff, not the extended stuff, so this is kind of the maximum of my character supposed to do. The guy punches punches you? Uh that's where I can help. No, actually my guy can take punch too, so Yay! Yeah, um <laughs> Okay, you <laughs> open the door, uh, it is dark inside. Um Yeah, I don't have blue light vision or a light. Or orcs don't do. No. Elves do. Elves do. I, I thought orcs might do that. Low light vision. Shed. Yeah, see, low light. You can see fire. See, see, look at that. Or uh -huh. still, <laughs> he can talk. He can see at night. What does happen though is you see a horrifying sight ahead of you. There is a lot of blood on the floor. Is it like Pee Wee Herman masturbating or something? No, I it's a lot of blood. Oh, what the <laughs> fuck? <laughs> <laughs> That's exactly what I wanted to hear. You know, that, of all the things I thought I'd hear today, talk about people hearing masturbating. It's a horrific sight. Not one of the things I thought we were going to talk about. Uh, <laughs> no, 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 no. We weren't no. talking about it until you added on to what I said. Okay. For, at first it was just a statement, now. now it's a conversation. Talk about something else now, please. I don't want to imagine this. Okay, he's he's stuck stuck off the boat <laughs> God damn it. Oh, shit. Uh, <laughs> but what's the sight of? Uh, it's, it, there's blood on the floor. There's a lot of blood here. Well, he can see it. Can he make a perception check? Because I can't see mm -hmm. this one. Well, are you going to turn on the light or something? Oh, there's a light switch? I didn't see it. <laughs> <laughs> Gee, I wonder why. Well, I, I don't know. As you, as you guys walk, who's, who's in well, the lead We here? just opened the door, and yeah. Yeah. he sees a dark room. I see blood. You see a lot of blood all over the floor. Uh, I'm going to tell him, go ahead. See, <laughs> <laughs> so you, you, like, you walk in, you flip the light, and yes. it feels tacky. It feels tacky. Okay. It's like, it's like a movie theater. Yeah. No, no. The mm -hmm. light switch is tacky. Oh, okay. And it flips open and it looks... It's a horror show down here. Yay, horror show. I don't think this guy knows what's uh, happening. I, I think house. he became a ghoul. Just <laughs> set, putting that out there. Which I actually hate less than you. Okay. <laughs> He's a ghoul. Uh, He's just, just to make sure, I no, brought... He still have, like, the, how many I brought my Warhawk. What is your Warhawk? The the Ruger okay. Super Warhawk heavy okay. pistol. Just bring, them, just say. Is that about to come out? Well, yeah. I mean, I brought it with, with this horror show. I'm. Uh, I think I'll bring up my close weapon, uh, close range weapon too, just in case. Hmm. On the break, and uh, anything, anything else? Uh, what's going to happen is we're going to roll <laughs> some initiative. Hey, fighters get to fight. But I'm not there. Then you're not a fighter. Yes, I am. You're, you're not the sole fighter. We, we fight. We, we don't do much else. That's true, really well. So it's initiative time. Yay! I roll initiative really well, too. Well, that's good for you. Hello, kitty. So what's initiative? Yep. Alright, there should be. Oh, what's your reaction? Uh, what's your guy's name, by the way? Uh, my guy. The eye on here. No, that's what? intelligence. Dragon. Uh, yes. Yeah, but let me see. G R A G. I can't really rotate because right. I'll. And what's your guy's place. name, by the way? Uh, I don't know. Does right. he have a name on here? Make a name. No. What, what is your name? Uh, Chuck Berry. Chuck. All right. What page is this? Hmm. What the page was this? All right. Uh, one twenty six. Now. Okay. I rolled a two. Um, And what? Oh. I don't see it on here. So do you don't see it? Initiative? No. What? What's initiative stats? It's intuition and. Oh wait, no, no, no. How do you calculate it again? I think it's just three out here. Hmm. Oh, it's. Uh, eight plus one die plus. A plus that, that, that's standard initiative. Does, right. he, does he have any cyber? Yeah, it's a little uh, little cyber little. arms and your youth, obvious. That's it. Okay, so roll a die six. Yeah. Just, just one? Yep. It's nice to look at this. Three. So you got an 11. 11, hey, you get two passes. So, you see, peeking up amongst the, the wine barrels on the tacky floor, and they drop something that lands heavy to the floor. Um, Who does? 
three hairless, uh, heavily cataract beings come loping towards you. So you brought, you brought your relatives with you, huh? Nice. <laughs> That's, uh, I'm liking your hate back. It, it makes my character more real. What uh? What do you guys do? Um, how, how far away are they? They're gonna be within like thirty feet. Thirty feet. Chuck's on deck with us, so you want to prep? Um. Safe to say, I have my Chuck? pistol out already. Hmm? You you mean Gregan? Gregan is, is you get to go. Right, I know. You're, uh, oh, I'm sorry. Uh, 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 not bad, Thirty feet yeah. away. It's that a heavy pistol. Time for at least one arrow, right? Yep. Let's see what did that do? Who's me? You under nine ten out combat rifles. Yeah, it's just. I haven't What's uh? Uh, go. What goes with pistol? Um, pistol. there would be agility. Agility and pistol is how many dice you roll. We should probably try and keep this quiet. So I would suggest, uh, or, or, oh, maybe I should pull out my battle axe. Yeah. Go, ahead, go, run it up, go for it. I'm using arrows, so those are quiet. I guess I'm going to try and shoot one. Same, in. same skill in there. The danger blades. Yeah, yeah, it's three right. also, though, so three. it doesn't really change for me. So I roll uh, my archer, correct? Three, yep. such your agility, so seven. I got you. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Well, what are you doing? Two. He is shooting at the guy. I thought we were being quiet, though. Uh, archery. He's archery. Oh, okay. He, he pulled that's out right. a class of bullets, but he popped one. Yeah, that's how I got the arrow off, too. Quiet. Uh, I hit. I got three hits. You beat my one hit. Yay. So how much, da- how much damage does it do? Uh, two, two plus your weapon damage, and it doesn't do any pure thing. Uh, let me, give me a second to find it. Okay. Eight. It does minus two AP. So, oh, I'm sorry. He damage uh, damage twelve physical AP minus so two. So fourteen damage minus two AP. You shoot one in the head and it goes down. It lets out a little yelp and drops. How loud a yelp? Not, not loud enough to really make a whole lot of noise. So okay, so no one heard it. All right, you get to play next. And there, you said approximately thirty feet. Yeah, so you can move up and take a swing if you wanted to. Yeah, I'll do that. Right up in the middle of them, swinging your battle. You said there's three. There are two, two left. Okay. I just one hit. My guy's nimbly dodged to the side. Dude, I roll bad. <laughs> How many dice are you rolling? Enough. Uh, and I should be getting more. Got a lot of twos, and threes. I'm glad they're not one. <laughs> Dude, I'm telling you, I roll the worst. I always have. One takes it. One of them tries to swing and caught you. So reaction. Reaction plus intuition. Uh, two hits. You dodge the first one. Roll the same. Roll it again because the second one tries to claw you. But this time you lose one dice on it. Because every time somebody tries to hit you, you lose another die. One hit. Okay. So I beat you by three. So I'm doing 10 points of damage. However, now you duck. You get to you, you roll your body plus armor, and I'm going to subtract one point of armor. So your body of what? Seven. With your armor of uh, 12. So you get to roll uh, uh, 19. 19 dice. And you have to. You're going to take 10 damage for every hit you get. You subtract it. And then it's your turn, by the way. My turn. Yep. Alright, um... And if you target the one he swung at, it has... It's fine. Shoot away! Jesus, boy. Four hits. So you take six points of damage. Oh boy! So you're at a minus two for all your stuff, because it's clawed deep in you. Um, but, so six points... What is your armor? Okay, so this is stun damage. It didn't pierce your armor. Stun damage. Let, let, Sun uh, heals at one. If you take an hour long break, you get to roll body and willpower and get that many bodies. I don't think these things are going to wait an hour. <laughs> well, not right now. They're going to try to eat your face. Yeah, I know. <laughs> but after an hour, if you chill down. All right. Um. Let's see. Where's my other weapon? Let's see. I should have just shot at it. Hang on. Hang on. I'm pistol at this fucker. 
Right. Well, you got the you got the combat axe. Um. Yeah, but we saw how well that works. Not every day gets to be awesome. <laughs> yeah, I live in a day to day of shit though. <laughs> Shadowrun, I can't roll for shit ever. Okay, so I got a question because I didn't notice this before. All right, so my uh, weapons have accuracy, and I have skills and that. So it? accuracy is the maximum number of dice you can succeed. Okay. Perfect. Like you can't take, you cannot be an Olympic class sniper with a gun I beat the hell out of with a hammer in my backyard. Sure, I can. I just gotta be really, really, really good. Yeah, you have to spend some edge. <laughs> or be like dragon. All right. Um, you know, be, will I be able to shoot these things? With yeah, you? you can shoot with your buddy in there. Well, I'm s okay. Just want to make sure. Um, it'd be better to help. Okay. Can I rock there, position myself in between one and swing at the other? With what? Uh, my combat axe. Yeah, you can. All right, so I'm gonna try and put myself in the line of fire for this guy I hate, because I want my money, and he spares a jump blocker later. If I die, you get more money though. No, you don't. No, I don't. No? It's per person. I, I might charge a tower to who I uh, just for saving your hide though, because I hate you. <laughs> All right. So then, for this blades, one, two, three, four, five, six. I'm putting myself in between one swing at the other. One, two, three. Four hits, my maximum number. <laughs> you beat me by, well, three. So I take three plus what's your combat axe do? Combat axe. Where'd it go? Combat axe. Damage 10, minus 4 AP. So you do 10, 13. I strike three. That that ghoul is barely hanging on. Oh really? I didn't just drop him with my minus four and ten and thirteen damage. Thirteen, but I got three hits that time. So oh. Oh, okay. He did fourteen. I have eleven. He has one. He's you chopped big into him, and he's kind of. Like, ah. he's, he's still in shit. <laughs> no, he's in worse work. condition than you. You yeah, ugly yeah, fuck. Yeah, I'm just stumbling over there. <laughs> I'm semi drunk, a little stunned from being No, attacked. there's no known cure. For um, H M V V. Yeah. So what's going on with you guys? Th they're you turn by the way. They're they're, they're ba you guys left them. Yeah, I know they're that. <laughs> that was probably like you guys can be like streaming video like oh hey we went to the place we we're gonna do this to be a real milk run we're oh fuck <laughs> there's <laughs> <Wolf> now <laughs> they're eating my face <laughs> so who are you swinging at by the way. Your turn, by the way. Uh, isn't there two down now? Th there's no. no, there's one who's barely up and one who's full up. What, one's got one hit. So I'm going to go for that weak one. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just going to... I don't feel confident in myself right now. Minus one, correct? He has minus one, yeah. So swing away. Uh, more than minus one. Well, he, uh, he mm -hmm. said minus. And you said it was agility, right? Yep. Agility plus your um, your your melee weapon stat. Did you know that? Which is minus dice. One hit. One hit? I got one success. <laughs> He's got minus two. Oh, yeah. Because he took a thing to the face. Yeah. All right, so my guy's going to try to swing at you. So, uh, I want yeah. you, Billy. The one that only has one HP? Yeah. All right. Well, was it 19 dice or no? It would be 18 now, right? Three hits on you, by the way. Huh? Am I, wait, am I taking damage or just... No, I'm, 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 right now we're dodging. So I'm swinging at you. 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 Three hits on you. Oh, three hits on me. Yeah. Okay, and that's uh, reaction. Plus and then the other one's going to try to bite you. What do I roll for that? Um, Reaction plus intuition minus two because you're hurt. It's reaction plus intuition. Alright, so it's one, two, four, five, six, Two hits. You beat me. You dodge out of the way of the other bull. Sheer luck. Whatever right. you don't hit, it's um. I have to go to the bathroom. The claws do seven points of damage, yeah. physical, and one minus one armor. All right. But I'm correct me if I'm wrong, but you said intuition plus reaction. Reaction plus intuition. And so that would be rolling thirteen dice. Yes. All right. Just making sure. Lots there of hits. There you go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I think I beat you. Uh, his head? <laughs> it's gone. <laughs> and I'm still struggling with the one that's almost on the floor. <laughs> this is why I hate orcs. They're useless and ugly. Ooh, no, matter, <laughs> no matter what character I play, I'm going to roll like this. I don't know what it is. I've always rolled like this. I, I normally don't roll as well, so... 
Alright, so then it's... It'd be an issue of time again because we've taken two combat rolls, I think. Mm hmm Yeah. You need to hold in a bottle of alcohol in this photo. <laughs> <laughs> it's Molotov, though. I should better with my hands. I should just no. My skill is better, but it's not gonna do damage. Right. I don't know how to do it really well. Because you guys are still at the party here. Yeah. That's what they're doing. Well, I'm not afraid to make this character go like falls out because I'm only using him the one time. So if he dies, it's no big deal. Uh, if I go out in a blazing glory, I'm fine. Oh no, I know that. That's Whatever makes a better story, I guess. I planned on killing you at the end of. No, I can't. <laughs> <laughs> My brother did that. He, he had a big ass Yeah, yeah. No, you're right. You're right. Yeah. yeah. Basically, he gives me a spear my I let him go. <laughs> I'm still right here. I know. Hell, I, I, could, I could kill you at the end, just like, oh. He's like, he didn't make it. Like, oh no. It's <laughs> like the ghoul got him. At, at your current condition, yes. It could happen. I do all this shit, but then like, I'm like, I'm going to put my gun at him, and I'm getting hit, 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 hit. And then you just glitch. It could happen. It could happen. It could happen. But it won't. No, I'm just kidding. I don't know, it could, man. Yeah, very well could. It's like you say one more racist thing about my teeth. <laughs> <laughs> my, my, or, or heritage. So I will have to do something. You could have I don't want to kill your character, though. Yeah. I could, though. It, it could. Just a battle axe. <laughs> Back with it. Never saw it coming. Poor guy. Actually, because it would be a stomping, I might actually be able to be fine, because... Well, I won't be fine, but I might have a better chance to react against it. Played with my brother, and he, he was a troll, and he shot me in the ass with a bow <laughs> just because he was killed me. <laughs> Which is up closer. <laughs> <laughs> Took out half my life. Mission was over. He just wanted to be a jackass. <laughs> he would have felt kind of bad if he'd actually killed you. Well, <laughs> me, I was playing with four of my brother or three of my brothers, and two of us. One was game game master, and. Uh, the, me and my one brother were two trolls. My other one was a dwarf. And there was a hallway full of people that we couldn't get past. So we just hurled my brother, who's a dwarf, as the two trolls and just hurled him down the hallway. <laughs> 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 fucking react or see as a good uh, distraction to bring attention away. <laughs> yeah, they're like, uh, we're going people bowling with the dwarf. Let's do this. It's a real competition. I believe it. I mean, dwarves are one of the few species they can take the guy yeah. about it. Well, a troll, a troll, I bet, could hurl a dwarf pretty far. Oh, yeah. Oh, too high ceiling. My bad. <laughs> Just wanted to get some spin on it, you know? Shit. Oh, yeah. Do you know if, um... If you have an unarmed combat skill, but is there a way where your character is an alcoholic? Uh, or wait, no, it wasn't that. It was not a combat. It was more like charisma. Can you have a charisma skill that gets better if your character character is al alcoholic and it gets increased somehow because he like just I don't know he's better when he's an alcoholic? Is there a um, way for that, or is it in the books anywhere? Silas, he's Silas sleeping. Uh, Silas would know. I don't think so, though. Or Ed would know. It looks like it. <laughs> he, he didn't um, sleep last night, so. Yeah, I got off work at 6 in the morning this morning. Oh, oh those are fun. Yeah. I went to bed at like, within like 10 before I came here. That's why these days are hard for me, because then I also have my son. I gotta get back at some point and then go to work tonight at 10.30. Oh, that's not fun. Yeah, that's why these are hard for me to do. 
Same thing with Thursday. I think, well, I don't have my son on Thursdays, but I do work that night. Right. Wait a minute. I don't want this thing. Hmm. I mean, I guess we could surprise that until we all write Voldemort and shit again. Yeah. <laughs> so they haven't won though. Oh, that's right. So you're probably going to be on deck. Me? Or you're probably going to be up because you've only... I already took two turns. Oh, yeah, and I took... Two. Yep. They were just... I don't know. Do you get? Do they even know what's going on with you and me? Um, I, I don't think we've been texting them, giving them updates. Like, nope. well, I'll just shout out. <laughs> you like almost got Probably eaten. Had LOL. Had <laughs> Headshot. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> Head yeah. Ghoul. LOL. <laughs> Snapshot. Oh, you know, hey, selfie. Well, I told you to tweet this. <laughs> <laughs> you get go. Um. Okay. I take a we, we noticed. So I'm going to leave the unhealthy one for you. If, it you, seems like it if you can kill it right now, do it. Because I don't want to take a chance. Well, well no, I mean... Well, I, I'm doing pretty good, and currently I'm between the so other So you're going to walk away? Yeah, you, you're going to kill that one. It's yeah. your job. Do something! I'm trying. This is the last area. So, Alright, so... Uh, I believe it's six... I'm rolling awesome. Four hits again, my max one. Who are you hitting? The big one or the are we one? The big one. The one that's speaking uh that I'm in between him and okay. him. Two, you beat me. Yay. How much damage are you doing? Um again it's ten damage with four AP. And you, how many did you? How many hits did you get? Uh, I got four. Okay. For uh, yeah, show off. Okay. I'm only rolling six die. I'm not too proud. I rolled nineteen. I still didn't even get six. So hits. five minus twelve is seven. Seven damage. All right, he's hurting. Okay. Your turn, Chuck. Oh yeah, Chuck Berry. <laughs> Is it, isn't Chuck Berry the Motown yeah. guy record label? Sexy songs, yeah. Yes. Yeah, <laughs> Uh, I guess another taking another swing. Oh, oh, Barry White, because I'm thinking. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> oh, Barry Gordy is who I'm thinking of, right? Yeah, Barry Gordy, Motown, is that right? Chuck Berry was Motown too. He was Johnny Good. Okay, so either one. I'm, I'm thinking of Gordon, but all right, anyway. either here or there. We got it. Motown, Temptation, we're good. Uh, blades and what was it? Agility? Yeah. But minus one, right? Plus two. One hit. One hit. How many dice do you roll? I rolled three. I rolled five. <laughs> God. Why couldn't you just kill like him? I'm telling you, dude. <laughs> Alright, the shitty one's gonna try to hit you. Ready? Yeah. The not so shitty one's gonna try to hit you. Okay. Mm, six. Minus one or two? Two. Two. Damn it. You're hurting. I know. Intuition and reaction. Right? Mm hmm. Two hits. You win. Sweet. Mm. So we're both yeah. fucking up on each other. Like we can't. We're like we're trying to hit each other. We can't uh, do it. A little flat fight. Four. I have one hit and three glitches. So. Oh. God. <laughs> it's <Yeah>. a critical glitch. <laughs> you don't like me. No, no, no. It's just a glitch. You said one hit. Oh yeah. Well, no, I I failed to hit him. <laughs> oh. Well, it's still not perfect. Alright, so you. Alright, we'll try and kill the one that swing at me, giving you one more chance. Yeah. <laughs> uh, one, two, oh, three. 
triple count. Four, five, six. Um, three. That'll do. He's dead because I have one hit. I have five hits, but I have no defense. <laughs> well, so basically, Shouldn't now that I hit you, ten damage. Well, uh, you uh, did. So how many hits did you get? I got three hits. That's thirteen damage. Mm -hmm. I have um, a body of seven. Mm -hmm. So seven. You tw um, twelve minus seven is five. Mm -hmm. That's how much damage they can kill. I cannot. Like, okay. I, if I soak everything, I'd still die. Oh, so <laughs> yeah, he's <dead>. you. <laughs> I don't like this. Right? <laughs> it's like I'm nervous when I come to my turn. Hey, two hits. You beat me. <laughs> Your minimum damage will kill. <laughs> okay. Good job. Yeah. You, you killed a one-hit point in the ghoul. So useful. Do you stand in this room? He, 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 he the character is good. I'm not. <laughs> you stand in a room full of gore and ichor. Yeah. Ichor. You have quietly killed goons. There's a door that leads to the main building. Hmm. So we're in this guy's building right now, mm -hmm. and there's just. Mm -hmm. You stepped into a horror show. No, oh, it just doesn't make sense. Lowell so selfie he shot shot to uh, the other people. It's like two why's your dick out? <laughs> <laughs> um no. Oh, health pack on him. You're gonna heal me? Yeah, you, you know what? No, I'm tossing it to you. I'm i I'm just stunned though, right? Mm. Oh yeah, you are just stunned. Never mind. You can be stumbling around. Hmm. I went in there stumbling. You came out a lot more stumbling. <laughs> <laughs> All right. With that in mind, let's. Uh, nothing to see here. Now let's take a nap. That sounds so worse. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Did you die at me? No, I threw a pretzel. Very good. It's dog with you. And I don't want my dog pooping out dice. You already pooped out your butt. <laughs> Oh really? I'm going to that perler beads. I'm going to diabetic needle cover. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna make a fail of the attempt of a perception roll. All right. Okay. Apparently my fails aren't fails. I got four, three hits out of four dice. Um, I, I normally fail these. Yeah. Um, nothing to see here. There's nothing to see here. It's quiet. Goodbye. Um, but it's. Uh, like, you ooh, can hear I don't the raspy breathing of other ghouls throughout the building. Joy, more fights. Let's do this. Uh, uh, Rob, how about you tell you stealth? You can stealth up there if you want to. Yes, let's, let's try and stealth. Because, why not? I just did it. I did it. Whatever. Because if this is the battery on this laptop is shot, so if it comes up, it should be done. So you guys can roll a stealth if you want to and try to sneak past the wolves. We're going to fight him one way or the other. Do you want to stealth or are you going to call for backup or what are you doing? Oh, there are three guards outside. The three guards outside, they, 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 they don't know that there's this place is a hive full of ghouls. Ooh, open the front door. So or do yeah. they? You want to open, open the front door and just... They're like, woohoo, there's ghouls in here. <laughs> no, no, not just even that, just open the front door and make, you know... Maybe let them <laughs> let them recap it throughout the... You know, the high class. Area. How do people even get ghouls there? Hmm? It's supposed to be a high class area, right? Alright. Oh, man. I kind of just. So, if you want to let out the well, semi intelligent zombies, go for it. Semi intelligent? Yeah, but we let them out we don't got to deal with them. They're the world's problem. Keep an eye out for helping. Yeah, yeah, of course. Um, okay, so, uh, how. I think we'll attempt to, uh, I'm going to attempt to sneak through the front door because this seems like a bad idea. Are you going to leave? Uh, if you're coming with me, you better roll. I got two hits. Mm -hmm. what, did, he's going to get to the front door and open it up and just make a whole bunch of noise and uh, lure the ghouls out. Oh, wait, no, wait. I, I, I'm going to try and sneak to the front door and get the guards and the ghouls to have it out it themselves. <laughs> no, no, no. Do you want to go with them or no? Uh, well, what's the layout? Like, what's... We forgot the layout. Like, 
What kind of room are we in right now? You what guys are in a kind of offsite. It's a basically a circular tower. It's inside in the center is a central air column that kind of for heating and cooling. Um, in the center there's also an elevator. Off of the second floor is Lord Helsing's um, private chambers, and that's where his voting box would be. Because he, as long as you know that it's hicked up on a node that he can privately vote to Parliament from. So. But isn't it, we kind of came there for. Yeah, yeah, that's where you, if you go to there, you could cast the vote. Yep. So, let's, uh, that, that's why I'm trying. I would say, don't do that. Don't get the guards involved because then okay. we don't know how that'll turn out. Okay. All right. Might so as well just go against one enemy instead of maybe two. All right. Then let's try and sneak our way that way. Give me a stealth check from you. Agility plus stealth. If there's nothing in stealth, just agility. Oh, you can sneak. You do have skills. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm just. This stealth skill group two. Yeah. So two. Two plus your agility. But minus two. Mm-hmm. So. Two. Sure. Hey! Same here. Good. You get past. We, we did everything to you. You guys sneak up. We're like barely doing this. <laughs> <laughs> we have no skills, but we're doing it. You sneak up to the second floor. Mm-hmm. Um, and you can get into, go down this kind of small hall, which leads to his personal um, chamber. In this room, um, you see Lord James Helsing strapped to a chair uh, before a table with his comlink. The, uh, the device is currently on uh, and he's covered in blood and half-chewed flesh that are kind of dripping from his jaw. A strip of sinew hangs from his mouth, saliva mixed with blood running down his front. This is someone's been a feminine elven hand is gripped in his free hand and he occasionally gnaws on it. His right wrist is shackled and bolted to the table, forcing his hand onto some sort of scanner. Oh. His left is on a chain, able to reach his mouth, holding the hand he is eating. You see, um, there is a retina scanner that's basically been jammed into his head and is currently active. Nice. So, there's no video camera, just knowing that he's voting. And he, is, he is currently set up, able to vote. Awesome. I like this. And there's a there's basically a grizzly um, keyboard and a, uh, a uplink that shows an up that shows a number of different votes that he can cast votes upon. Okay. And one of them is the vote you are interested in. Yeah. So what's the one that lady? Which one did she want us to vote for? She wanted you to say yes on fourteen forty nine. But if we come in close to the guy, he'll try and grab us. Well, he's currently both down. Like if you, like you can touch the keyboard, but if you go, yeah. Okay, then let's safely go to the keyboard. Um, actually, first a fail of a perception check, just to make sure I'm understanding. Uh, two. Okay. Three. Yay! I love it when it looks clear. Sneak up to the keyboard. Okay. And I should I'll uh, attempt to vote yes. You hit the button here, ah, reaches at you, but he can't. He looks like a a nice desiccated British aristoc- uh, aristocrat. Okay. You get you wearing like a bow t- or a tie, like a. Oh, he he yeah. did have a nice uh, fancy clothing on, but <laughs> it's Pee Wee <laughs> it's, it's horribly horribly stained now. Do you want to get the hell out of here? Um, at the moment, no. I'll wait. I won't wait a little bit. Maybe catch some boats and some other stuff so it seems less suspicious. Alright. Hopefully. Um, with that, I'm going to send the information and which way the boat's going to her so she can post on the form. Yeah, I'll do that. Alright. So now you know which way it's going, it's going the way the other person wanted. Um, I'll make another fail for perception check. Nice. Again, two hits. See, looks clear. Yay. Alright. So since I've double checked, it's definitely safe. You guys just getting the hell out of here? Um, is there any other things he can vote on? Yeah, you can catch. There's like 40 different things you can catch votes upon. <laughs> just go crazy. Just fuck <laughs> shit up. <laughs> 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 not, not immediately. Um, 
I, I'm gonna, you know, sit down. Boop, 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 boop. <laughs> I'm gonna sit down. I'm in the house of Lord. This is gold next to you. <laughs> uh, yeah, no, I, I think I'll go sit in the corner um, for an hour or two. Catch another boat. Repeat for four hours. You're in. It's not gonna take four hours. No, no. But well, no, it's you're in a like you heard other ghouls oh, sleep see, so throughout so this so building. Oh, so there other ghouls are sleeping. Okay. <laughs> in that case, um, yeah, we'll cast some votes on some other stuff. Right? Anything that could directly relate to me, <laughs> it doesn't have Sam. You're not even from this country, are you? <laughs> we can mess with it. Boop, 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 boop. No, well, we don't. I'm voting. <laughs> <laughs> we, we don't want to just go random, actually. So uh, vote on two of them, whichever way I feel like it. Uh, <laughs> four, four, nine, eight, B. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> You're in favor of pedophilia? No. <laughs> <laughs> um, no are, are we trying to do this virtue? Uh, well, he's a ghoul now, <laughs> so <laughs> mission accomplished. But he wouldn't really care about pedophilia, he just wants to eat the kid afterwards. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'll contact Chicky too and tell her, you know, mission accomplished. Uh, she will. Let's see. Hmm, any way I could. Mm -hmm. Is there anything here I can set up so in a day or two the whole place will burn down? You could just, like, send an anonymous. Hey, that house is full of ghouls. Well, the problem is they could suspect and redo the vote, so we have to wait till afterwards to do that. So, because we don't want them checking out till after it's been passed. This one's trying to set the time. I would imagine they did not they'd they be like, electronic, but it's very submitted, right? They're gonna be mm -hmm. naturally. Yeah, but they could sit, I'll say, wait a minute, that vote wasn't submit, always couldn't, mop, couldn't have been submitted by a ghoul, someone's faking it here, like we just did. So, trying to hold off on that if possible. I like wait a week, wait a week, and then uh, throw it on. Kill, kill the ghoul version, and then take them with. So I like this. Um, eliminates the whole. No, it seems a little I suspicious. He, he he voted for the weirdest things and just disappeared. <laughs> <laughs> he voted for three things and disappeared. Yeah. Well, he's already been disappeared for a while, so. So we don't have a spot to hide the body. I, I say we uh we we then before our turn. Or said. What's the vote is in? Isn't it in? Yeah. Yeah. So like even if they find out who's a ghoul, they wouldn't do it. Yeah. Well. I, I want to wait till after the event to report it, just to be safe. Okay. So we should have to try and sneak out now, though. I will let you guys sneak out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I will <laughs> let you sneak out. <laughs> well, it it comes down to like half the party hasn't been able to do anything for the last like hour. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> and so I kind of started to just finish off of it. <laughs> so you post on there within five minutes. Large amounts of credit show up in your account. Um, do you, mm. do you contact the good lady? Yeah. A lot more credits put into your account. Um, so you tell the media that the the house the housing manor is full of rules. Yeah. Okay. Uh, cut off the. Uh, no, hang on. <laughs> Before you do anything, guys. We we kill that guy first, and uh, we we take out how the evidence that looks like he was being forcibly used to vote. <laughs> just just <laughs> the, the more I'm thinking about this, yeah. Are you sure none of your traps, uh, fingerprints? Yes, or yes. Yeah. Carefully kill and remove Carry all. Carry him with you, with your combat <laughs> axes. <laughs> Careful. <laughs> 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 right. I mean, if you get a moose and let the other ghouls in, then they're going to eat him. And only well, no, no, he's dead. Him. He's he's a ghoul as well. He's a ghoul. Ghouls are not into cannibalism. They just eat other people. Yeah, yeah. they they need fresh meat. Well, you could be dead. But we don't know how it all happened. How 
the whole Google thing happened. He got bit, brought back, ate one of his servants, and yeah. But who has who has tied him up and is forcing him to vote? Uh, the elf lady. Ooh, <laughs> the elf lady that is eating. Oh, if we find an elf lady with no hands. <laughs> 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 no, 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 it's less likely to find her still in one piece. But their way. Uh, so the the vote patch. Good job, everyone. If we take her hand, and we might yeah. be able to find her fingerprints. Yeah. Can we try that? You want to take the ghoul hand? The, no, the not, ghoul hand? not ghoul hand? Not ghoul hand. Yeah, you can take it. Yeah, uh, it you have a uh, HMVV infected hand. Awesome! <laughs> Wait, hold on. We, strain we have cool? the virus! Uh, what Wait. strain is this? Yeah, what strain is cool? It's the same Three. one. Three. Uh, I want two. I want two. <laughs> well, no, one makes you a vampire. No, two. I, I thought it was two that makes you a vampire. What does one make you? I thought it was like annoying. What makes you annoying? Oh my god, he caught the gay! <laughs> <laughs> there's like, there's three versions of it. Okay. And then there's a subtype of one of them that makes you super powerful. Like That one, that's the one I want. Yeah, no, they're not going to do that. Um, what put in the game? You can't have it. They put stuff in the game yeah, for home game stuff. Like, like for games. In the in that book right there, they give rules on how to trick out your pad. Like you can have cool stuff at your house, but the problem is, like, you don't spend a whole lot of time there in the game. Yeah, it's but it's so just there for like home games. Yeah, in home games we could do all kinds of crazy shit. Yeah, in home games you could be an astrologer. Yeah. So in this game, what happens is you guys all get paid. Yay. You don't give a shit. Nineteen thousand credits. Twenty four hours later, a semi anonymous news tip comes to Horizons, and an investigative team, is, a journalist team, is eaten, uh, <laughs> <laughs> as several ghouls pour out of a manor, um, and... Uh, manor is then quarantined. There's quarantine, and lots of firefights, and the dead body of not Lord Helsing is found. Helsing is found. Um, there is a massive investigation. Art does not care. Art is your contact. Um, Wait. He already paid us. Yep, he, he wants, he, he's happy. He got his vote. Lots of lots of services have been changed. Um, Some random votes, like, why in the world? You guys get um, Art Johnson uh, as a contact. Because um, you didn't contact him with the emergency thing. Yay. I need a pen. You all get 19,000 again. No. So there's 9,000 from the chick, 9,000 from her. Morning bosses, they might give us. Uh, um, you get one. Uh, you get one street cred. Um. Hey, good job. None of you were completely unprofessional at the ball. We didn't <laughs> kill anybody. Yeah. <laughs> Otherwise, I, you would have got. The first thing I did notoriety. Was you would have had a record. Well, no, you would have got notoriety, and notoriety. Makes it make you get a negative cer for certain charisma rolls, um, and also none of you fucked up big enough to get thrown out of the ball, so there's no public awareness. Um, you're all gonna get six karma. Why don't you give us the papers we need to? They don't actually have them for this. So nineteen thousand new yen, six karma. You get art as a street contact. And what is he? Um, he's a contact. Basically, like you know somebody at local, you can talk to I know, but what's his his uh, profession? Um, he is... A fixer? Or? He's not a fixer. He what was the other thing? Random Johnson. What's his uh, uh, reading? I'm going to check. I don't know if they have it. I'm just getting someone else. I want to use it. Here we go, by the way. Here's uh, Lord James... He's got a, such a lovely picture. Hmm. Was that the ghoul? Oh, uh, yeah. no, no, he, yeah. he, he is right. dressed like I thought it would be. Like, with the thing. <laughs> oh, the party wig. wig and <laughs> Not the party wig, I was talking about, like, the, uh, lacy thing. With the pendant. A dicky? Does he have a dicky? <laughs> Yeah, they don't give me any of this, so... Okay. Um, I will get you his stuff later, apparently. <laughs> they don't have it. Yay. Here we go. Here's... Here's how... 
So this cred? you get um, one street cred, cred because you let him out. cast the vote. Here, by the way, this 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 is perfectly sums up the sixth world of England. Like an orc, a troll, yeah. dwarf, all dressed up like losers in a bar mm. for a for a fucking <laughs> soccer match. <laughs> Man United. <laughs> Header. It's a well. They're, they're watching soccer. Head or Put the ball with your head? Oh. Or, or knock it into the uh, goal with your head? Yeah. Okay. I'm a soccer fan. I, I played. Yeah, I'm, with you. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm a football. I'm a football fan. You like? You that? just went down. My my, my last experience with soccer was in a sneaky league in elementary school. I was it shows. <laughs> I did I was recreational a soccer. Oh yeah, that's mostly what I do. But now follow the pass, but still, we're not we're not a running people. Okay, well, like, I used to like oh. Pele. Oh, Pele. <laughs> <laughs> but that is um, swing book. Next next month, when I figured out when it's going to be, uh, will be five minutes to midnight. Five minutes to midnight. We will keep working our way through the London stuff. Okay. okay. Hopefully, you all have bought the books by then. Yep. Yeah, we all Except for you, because I drag you into my adventures. Three dice did you put for three? Oh, I put it Yeah. Ah, I what if I just have it on my phone? I really want you to buy it from Tim, if you can. What, the book? Yeah. Yeah. It's, the it's core? What? It's nice the core part book? Covers. Yeah. And how much did he charge? Well, he probably charged like 50 bucks. Yeah. If, if you pay pay an actual cash, he'll uh, knock off the, uh, the pack for you. And so this is 50 bucks. More like the reason I'm asking everyone to buy it. Now I know you can. It helps you can him out. What? It helps him out. Well, I, I basically try to justify my own existence. He, he wants us. To, he wants us to be able to go down to the store Sunday versus his house every Sunday. Yeah. Well, I, I I know I don't do a whole lot of this. There's only so much time in my week. Uh, speaking of which, if you want more Shadowrun, I do. Uh, on I'm going to HeroCon. Not. Point. Next weekend, the weekend after. Which so is which day? Is Saturday. I, Saturday. The tenth. Saturday. The what? Tenth. Uh, the tenth. Yeah. I so I will be in HeroCon in yeah. Illinois. Is that one day? I'll be running challenge. Uh, it's a one day con. I'll be going for one day. I'll you be drive all, all the way out there and drive back that night. <sighs> if I get another driver, I'll switch. <laughs> um, <laughs> I, I'm. I might be able to go, but I have to double. Can you check your stuff out? I'm gonna go. If the more people we get going, the more we can split gas. That's going to be a fucking fun. Where is that? Illinois. Decatur, Illinois. And what's going on there? Is that near where Jessica was? Near DeKalb. No, that's Iowa. That might have been where we went. But what's going on in there? There's a convention. I'm going to go run we general. We went to a wedding. It may have been there. <laughs> Let's see. It started with a D. It definitely started with a D. Oh, I was even taking a look at the Motor City Comic Con and Nova this year. Well, let's go. Well, that's the week after that. Yeah. Is it a week or two weeks? Day, it's Decatur, Illinois. The one he's talking about is to be fair. It's the weekend right before Motor City Comic Con. Let's see. I'm, um. Uh, uh, again, we're going to see a picture. Be done. Let's see the Saturday event. I think it's going to be a bit much, but I volunteered before I knew I was going to have a job. See. Teaching Fridays. My heat. The Shadowrun people have their shit tight. <laughs> I mean, you could either leave after you teach on Friday, or like, leave real early on Saturday and come back on Sunday. Maybe. You want somebody else go? Well, that's why I was gonna, I'm gonna check, because I heard, like... It was like a six hour drive. Yeah. Is it a no is it a free convention or you yeah, gotta pay again, don't you? You probably gotta pay again. Yeah. It's probably gonna be anywhere between uh twenty to forty dollars. 
Ray Regal. Yep, that's me. Shadow Run Special Edition. Ray Regal. Good Ray Regal. Oh, that's me. I'm running Company Men. Shadow Run CMP 2014-07. Company Men 3. Run of the Gun. Wait. Rumor has it that Aries is about to unveil a breakthrough technology. Would you kindly go steal that thing for me? Yeah! <laughs> what? Would you kindly? Yes! A Shadowrun Living Campaign Mission, Shadowrun 5th Edition. Please check out Welcome to the Sixth World, uh, Make a Character. Also, they're doing um, the deck building game. Okay, uh, what if he took my for you to ask to see if you can find that one? I, I'm gonna post. Go to forum.shadowrun.com. Alright, four attendees, let's figure this shit out. Because <laughs> the other thing is, I know some of these people here. So yes, I might show up with the card as well, so. <laughs> <laughs> A one bay da badge is 15 bucks. It's not bad. So. 15 bucks for a day of You'll have to register online, do your own shit. Um, convention hours is 10 a.m. Oh, thank God. <laughs> oh, thank God. 10 a.m. It's still a lot to come back the same day. Well, no, 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. is the count hours. Oh, well, would it be likely to be from in character creation and critique? On Saturday morning. You'll have to go to the living campaign and post in there. Can I be a, sh can I be a vampire? So I'd get to, I'd leave her on like 3 a.m. to give me seven hours to get there, and then uh, wow. <laughs> yeah, bitch, this is what well, I do. So I, I I run a fuck ton. Of, five hours. It's five hours. Good. Well, I'll still probably leave her on four. Four a.m. So if I leave her on four a.m. here, if we all meet up here, we can park our cars. By the way, you guys are all local. Somebody stole my fucking um, oh, I'm smoker. A so if you guys give me information on it, I'll give you 50 bucks. Wait, you they stole your what? I have a smoker. Oh, okay. Like I. Oh, you know what? Uh, look on Facebook. There's a stolen property Facebook group where anything that people are trying to sell on Facebook, you know, for money or whatever. Mm -hmm. And they people, anyone missing anything, they sent a, put a picture up or anything, or if you watch it, do you have a picture of it? Yeah. I, we have a picture look. of it in the box. It was still in the box. Uh, and they left the fucking box. And took the fucking smoker. So what I want is if, if if you can give me information that leads me to be able to punch somebody in the face and pick up my smoker, I'll give you fifty bucks. I've got cash in my wallet right now. If I can, you can pipe, I'd recommend that group though. It couldn't it couldn't hurt. It What's it called? Uh, stolen property. Lead pipe teeth. Fifty dollars on the head. I'll send you. Uh, I'll send it to you over cool. Facebook. Okay. Yes. So I'm gonna figure out when next month will be for this. Okay. Go have fun, um, and we'll do more. Wait, what? What? Uh, next month is May, correct? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, so what, what's gonna happen is Levere and I are gonna we're gonna sit down and have a couple time and I can figure out when the fuck things are gonna happen next. Of course. Because well, no, con season is just heating up. Right. Next. Here's what's gonna happen very soon. Okay. Next weekend, I'm flying to Denver. Yay for you. I have to go to a con, or a convention, a real convention, like Big Boy Ed's an adult scientist convention. Um, that'll be fun. Then, the week after that... Is Jackson County, Michigan, stolen property notification and recovery group? Yes. Awesome. I was just sending you... So, that Saturday, I'm going to be home, and I hopefully will get to see my wife and go to church. She's going to be off at Banjo Land, which is not nearly as sexy fun as the movie Make It Sound. Um, <laughs> you know, who doesn't want to listen to Squeal Like a Pig? Uh, <laughs> okay. Wait, was it Warren Beatty? Or Ned Beatty? Ned Beatty was in Deliverance. Yeah, yeah. Squeal Like a Pig! You never heard this? So. Okay. Okay. Um, so, next Sunday I'm flying to... to Denver. I'll be going to Detroit first, but yeah. I'm going to Detroit. Or Detroit, Denver. Then I come back like Wednesday night, Thursday, Friday, actually go to work. So what are you going to Denver for? Uh, uh, I'm a researcher, so I'm going to go to a conference about eyeballs. 
which actually, fun fact, working in the Kellogg Eye Center is my own personal hell um, because I have a real big problem with cutting, cutting up eyes, so I get to watch that every day. Mm. <laughs> Not nice. because I'm retarded. Um, Wait, why are you? Why do you have a problem with cutting up eyes? Like you know what? I can uh, you stab you right in the heart. Thing. Fine. Just the, just the fact that you're cutting up people's eyes flips me off. Like, it's a like medical thing. My, my brothers are the same way. Well, Wyatt and Jed were like, I don't like... They were like, oh, fine. They put the contacts on. Noah's like, I I don't like that. I, I don't watch her put her contacts on. No, I, I, I understand that there's certain things that just freak people out. You know, I mean. Mind eyeballs. Okay. Um, Works. So, the fifth, flying away on a jet plane. The tenth, going to HeroCon. That next weekend, the 18th, is that, um, when is the thing with the labor stuff? Labor Day weekend. Labor Day weekend. When is that? September. What's the other one? Memorial weekend. When is that one? End of May. The 26th or something like that? Like the last weekend of May. Or the 21st. That was weird this year. I honestly don't know. I know we're the 20th. I don't know. 22nd like the 18th or the 24th. And okay. The 25th is Memorial Day. Okay. 22nd through the 24th. I'm going to go to Wisconsin. Good to you. Um, in that, that eight, the weekend of the 18th, I might try to do Super Super RPG weekend again. Where I do mm-hmm. shit. Where we do Pathfinder. Where the fuck were you? <laughs> I was sleeping. Okay. We were betting masturbating, so I'm, I bet you I'm not off. No, no, no. I, 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 I stayed up till like five making my character. And then I slept. And then I slept and was like, fuck you, alarm. You're a smart man. Full um, of logic yeah. and levels. Um, I've been told that. I wanted to share one. Don't do it Sunday of 17th of May. Fuck! Um, I'm sorry, but that's the well. I can't make it that week, so I mean, yeah. one thing so here's what's gonna happen, okay? I won't be able to. Make I'm gonna it tell you the truth, okay? Because that's here's why it's coming down, and I gotta talk to her, and she's gonna tell me why this is wrong for the family thing. That weekend is kind of when I have free. The next one, I'm going to Wisconsin. The weekend after that is LynxCon and Fowlerville. Fowlerville, I've got a buddy who's gonna run three days of RPGs. Oh, I might try to go do. Um, are we de- I'm, I'm a local coordinator for Dungeons and Dragons. In Remember, I said corporate whore. Um, so I'm probably going to go there, run D and D, try to get some Shadow Run in, and try to get some Pathfinder in for all three. Oh well, I have another ball going on. You should. It'd be I, fun. Oh yeah, no, I, I might be able to come with you for that <laughs> weekend. But fuck, we might even be able to camp and get <laughs> stay cheap somewhere. Um, yeah. Well. I mean, I grew up in house, so... Okay. Uh, so we'd, 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 that'll be then. That'll be the month of May. Fucking the first weekend of June, I'm going down to Columbus for Origins, and that's going to be 40 hours of Shadowrun. Yes! I am go- I'm playing. Are first, you going? Uh, I might now. 40 hours of Shadowrun sounds good to me. When's it start? The weekend? Uh, well, or- Origins Game Fair is... Are you still it's a student? Uh, we can lie um, twenty, 21, 21, so. No, are you still a student? At, high, at Lucky College. No. Well, you should whip out your, like, say you're a student of an electric college or whatever. Um, Why? Because you might get in for cheap. Oh, yeah, Origins okay. is the smaller of the two big conventions. It's a, uh, it's about 15,000 people. But most of the big head honchos are there. So there's a shitload of D&D. There's a shitload of, pat- well, there's no much Pathfinder for the, they, they're fighting with Pathfinder. Um, that's the big Shadowrun convention. That's where they make the they make a promise there. They don't turn people away. So they run about 150 percent of capacity. You, you'll have seven player tables, which is not as much fun. But it's they also do a tribute the tribute there to Tinner, um, who was one of the first guys who did. Uh, did you find it? <laughs> He's like, I'm getting my lead my lead pipe out. Well, no, I thought she looked mad for a second. I can't tell if she was mad at me or mad at other people. Do you guys ever check out those Facebook sale groups? Uh, I'm gonna. They're like a whole bunch of any, it's like an online garage sale. Of like, if you want to sell your TV or your phone or. I've checked it a couple. <coughs> but, so, 
the Motor Civic Comic Con I can't go to. But there's also, um, in May there's a con convention. In June there's an art convention. First week of August, last week of July is... You know I don't plan this far ahead. I have yeah. to. Yeah, no, I'm, well, you're, I'm listening to all this. I'm like, my brain's hurting. This is how, like, well, I'm an adult. Uh, like, <laughs> this is, like, if I want to be an adult and I want to have, like, real, like, working stuff, I have to have my shit together. You know, I run a shitty little website called Throat Punch Games, and that's getting me noticed. So, and they just published a fucking 40-page right. adventure with some people. Mm -hmm. I mean, one of us has to be a super nerd, so it might be you, right? I also, you will enjoy this. There's a group called Inroads Ministries, and they put a podcast called The Game Store Profits. They do. Um, well, it's it's Christian it's Christianity and gaming. Uh, oh, that reminds me. Yes. Um, have you heard uh, Baba Yatu from Civilization and your game? Uh, I looked up the translation. It was Baba Yaga. Baba Yatu. Okay. Baba Yaga is a Russian witch. No, it's... Uh, uh, Baba Yaga is the Russian witch, but Baba Yatu, I don't know. It, it's uh, actually a Swahili translation of Lord's Prayer, and it's actually the main theme for Civilization Four. Oh, nice. I know. Right? I also like Civilization Four because they got Leonard Nimoy to do all the introductions for all the technologies. It's the same thing with really? Five. Well, it, he's fun because it'll be like, uh, steam power. Sir, you're telling me you're going to set fire in the belly of a ship to power it against the wind? I have no time for you, sir. Good day! And yeah. he's talking about a steamship. Yeah, I got Civ's Rev uh, 5, and that one just... My computer couldn't handle it. <laughs> that was just too much. Hmm. Huh. Yeah. That made an instant official, uh... <laughs> I just thought it was really cool. I really like the song. Nice. <laughs> but you should check that out. I know you listen to stuff. I do listen to stuff. Usually. Game Store Profits. And then the other one is um, Game Store Profits and Saving the Game. Saving the Game does... Um, it's all role-playing stuff, but it's focused from a Christian slant. And they really love this one group of people who use role-playing games to help survivors and abusers of sexual assault. And they focus on children. So if you're like an eight-year-old who touched a five-year-old for some reason, they do role-playing games to kind of help you deal with that. And try to figure out why and help you. And they're actually licensed counselors rather than like, I have crystals. Um, yeah. But I will be posting stuff and keeping everyone abreast. What was the other one? Games for Profits and... Uh, Inroads Minute. Games for Profits is one of them in Saving the Game. Those are both uh, on <laughs> iTunes. And those are interesting ones. I just wrote an article for Inroads Ministries. The Games for Profits... Game or games? Game Store Profits. Yeah, that's uh, saving the game. Saving the Game. Okay. And they unfolded a die to make it look like a cross. I like this. That's cool. Oh. Alright. Here, let's see. Do I have my funny picture up there? Let's see. It's to your right arm, Ed. Nice. <laughs> Come on! You can do this! I really, really, really like that tie. Oh, that one? That, it's just you funny. need, well, if you go to fucking Origins with me, they're going to have a, uh, a, uh, uh, Children, Ch 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 Chessex, Chessex will have a booth there. Wow. Chessex. Chessex is the... Uh, Wonder Woman. Uh, Chessex is the dice company. Like, this is from Chessex. Okay. It's like Chessex, the iPods yeah. of... Uh, uh, I, I, I see of I'm at... I well, was at Tim's place just well, so I don't spend money there. Well, no, it's... You can. You can get these at Tim's, but... Chessex has all the dice. So yeah. I can get some special ones from Chessex and then those ones from Tim. Yes. Alright. Yeah. At Gen Con, they have a booth. <laughs> the powder dice. about the size of this room. 
And you have about a yard on each side for dice. Not even a yard. It's about the size of all these tables put together. A square. They they bring it in with a forklift and they set it down. And what you can do for five dollars, no, you take. You take I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about the, the precise ones. Oh, okay. But they yeah, they do that too. Where you can take like a um, a pitcher, grab dice. Here's money. Hey. Put it in a bag. Uh, I want to see this. I want to do this. Got it. Yeah. <laughs> There's, right. there's still accepting uh, application or uh, hey, it's, this is me. That's me. I wrote a thing. <laughs> I wrote a thing. I'm published. I made previews. <laughs> well, it's a different thing. This is this is I did for free. That that part down there with you and the hard hat. It's me. <laughs> that is a very clean hard hat. I know why we are hard hats. Well, no, that it's it's a thing they give out to children. Oh. <laughs> oh, it's on the plastic hard hat. Yeah, it's a che- it's a cheesy little one that I no. put on there because they thought I wouldn't wear it. I did. I know I, I uh, got some firemen and hard ass before. Those were fun to win. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so, but I will keep you guys abreast of when things are going to happen in the future. Yeah. Uh, and I'm interested. I Is that your new phone number, by the way? The one you texted me from? Uh, yeah, the. Um, Hold on a second. Is that because you had one and then you fucking disappeared? Oh, I'm sorry. I. I uh, gave my old phone to my younger brother because oh, I was trying to call him. He got weird. Uh. <laughs> he got weird. <laughs> Wait, did did she answer? And you're like, um. Well, that explains why you didn't text me. I totally forgot about sending a message to everyone. So no one knows my new phone number. Uh huh. Low low. Uh, Taylor. T a y l o r. Yeah. And what's your last name? Rand. R e y m o d. R e y m o d. Give them a silver ink part. Yes, you did. <laughs> well, I died. I I've been back. Go, no, come back. Fuck me. <laughs> <laughs> Only if you insist, Dad. Only if you insist. <laughs> no fibbing. So you're gonna need a ride, uh? Yeah. I'd rather not walk home. I'd rather do that. 